going. We're going to be setting up the perfect start. And we're going to be um, we're going to be creating something glorious and gorgeous together. Now, I need audience participation. I need specifically, 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 I need audience participation with regards to naming. I need the most overtly Soviet names for different districts. So chat, like when you're when you're when you're out there thinking, God, this potato guy doesn't know how to play Workers and Resources Soviet Republic. I don't want you to think that. I want you to think, God, this guy can't play Workers and Resources Soviet Republic. But I have a great name for that district, which is butchering over there. So keep that in mind. Keep that in mind. Right. Uh, we're going to be starting ourselves a brand new game. Now, um, we are playing the sort of test variant. So there's a whole bunch of like new stuff, uh, including water and sewage, which I have had a very, very minor sort of um, experience with. Uh, but not a crazy amount. Now, I want to play. I want to play in Slovakia. Um, I have no idea how this is going to work. So this has got the new, um, the new, what do you call it? The new, the new map boundaries. The ones that aren't perfectly square. The ones that are a little bit, uh, a little bit higgledy piggledy and sort of all over the place. So I'm really looking forward to testing them out. We're going to be customizing this. We're going to be customizing this because there's a couple of things that I really really like about hard mode and there's a couple of things that I hate about hard mode so let's go through these things and you know what you can rate my you can rate my um you can rate my look chat rate my look okay uh right so first of all we're gonna bump up the population because starting with a large population is just better um we are gonna start with an easy money amount we're not gonna start with unlimited uh we are going to enable no we're not gonna enable realistic mode uh we are going to put on uh, unsatisfied satisfied citizens reactions all the way up to heart we're going to do energy management for building and vehicles we're going to do water management we're going to do seasons as well we're going to do frequent building fires because we all know <laughs> we all know we all know how how building fires can rapidly spread uh global events are going to be enabled pollution is going to be enabled education simulation is going to be complex crime and justice is going to be enabled Good old mine fires. I knew somebody would get that reference. I knew somebody would get that reference. Uh, yeah. The great, what was it? The great mine fire of, was it 19, 1963? Was it a coal? I think it was a coal mine fire. I can't remember. Traffic simulation is going to be on complex. Researches uh, is uh, enable. Sure. Day night cycle. No. No, 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 no. We do not like day night cycle around here. We, we want it to always be the day. For sure, we want it to always be the day. Uh, year of start, what do we think, chat? 60, 70, or 80? I'm thinking, I'm thinking maybe we go for 70. I actually, um... I actually... I actually don't think I've ever started. I, have I ever started in the 70s? I'm really not sure if I actually have. 60s, a lot of demand for the 60s. To be fair, the 60s are, is nice because you, you get access to the, to the, to the earlier stuff. Okay, I mean, let's do the 60s. Okay, it's clear overwhelmingly people are in favor of the 60s. So let's do that. The best year for the Soviets? <laughs> I mean, I'm not I'm not sure if there were any best years. I mean, there was just less worse years. But anyway, right, let's jump into things and see what Slovakia has got in store for us. I'm really excited, actually. I'm really, really excited to see where this goes. But yes, we will be calling we will be calling our major city Potatograd. But even within Potatograd, we can have like little different industrial areas that I would really really like um, input on with regards to uh, names, chemical plants, industrial areas, the whole thing. We need we need different names for different bits and different bits and bobs. Also, I should say we've got a whole bunch of mods installed, like a ridiculous amount of mods. Not no, maybe not a not a crazy like ridiculous ridiculous number of mods but definitely enough to be um definitely enough to be called substantial right let's pause and sort of take stock of exactly what is going on here right okay wow this is this is funky dude this border is this border is absolutely tripping me up so first thing to note about slovakia is that we are entirely we're entirely landlocked which i actually really really like um i'm fed up with dealing with boats and they really don't work the way that you'd think that they do. I mean, I, they kind of do, but they, they really mostly don't. Uh, so what are our sort of major population centers here? What what do we reckon? Do we got any we got any Slovakia experts in the chat by any chance? We got any Slovakia experts? 
I mean, to be fair, we don't have like any. There's not. There's no like crazy large towns. What about um? What about if I have a little look at the uh, a little look at the map here? Okay. Wow. This is this is a big map. Lots of mountains for mines. Exactly. Um, three main areas of coal. Okay, that's cool. One major area. One major area of iron, like right over there. Right over in these mountains. Okay. Oil. Basically none. Although that being said, I tell you what, chat. What do we think about a nice early little oil production facility? By the way, we have one NATO border over here. Like, we have literally one tiny border. Actually, Brat Bratislava? What about Bratislava? Is that gonna be our... Maybe this is maybe this is our potato grad in waiting. Maybe we take the opportunity and just transform this area to potato grad. Let me crank down the volume a little bit. There we go. Hmm. Is Bratislava the biggest? Is Bratislava the biggest population center? I think it might be. What about uranium? A lot of little little pockets of uranium, and a little bit of uh, a little bit of aluminium. Okay, 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 okay. I feel like we can work with this. I feel like we can work with this. Exporting to Austria? Yeah, I think maybe. I think maybe that's that's a good idea. I think that's a good idea. So where 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 where's the oil field? The oil field is like literally over here. I think this is a good area. I think this is I think this is a good area. Hey Demi, how's it going? Uh, yeah, I think this is, I think this is nice. I think this is a nice area. I mean, this is relatively flat, so putting down a whole bunch of oil wells over here is, like, not a bad idea at all. Okay, uh, of course, there's a bunch of stuff that now complicates things. Um, I say a whole bunch of things. There's a whole bunch of services that we now have to add. How about iron? Iron is, uh, iron's, like, pretty plentiful. I mean, it's very, very plentiful, as you can see on the on the mini map here uh but it is quite inaccessible i feel like maybe instead of immediately trying to get steel processing up and running um maybe i actually see if i can start making some money in the first instance so in terms of like exit points we've got the large customs house over here we've got foreign workers as well which are uh, which are available a uh, small amount of tourists due to low trip rating i mean what are you talking about? What are you talking about? There's, <laughs> Bratislava's a lovely place to go this time of year. March 1960. Okay, so we got an exit point over here. It's only a small exit point. It's only a small exit point. Also, maybe let me see if I can... Hold on. Let me see if I can put that up there. Uh, yeah, make it slightly slightly smaller. There we go. That's good. So you can see happiness up there. Cool. Uh, yeah. I, so we got a, s a small sort of exit point over here. This is definitely somewhere that we could go to get, uh, well, we could get one train, one train route going through here. I think trains are probably, I mean, you know, probably what we're going to use to move oil around. Um, alternatively, there is, there is pipelines that we can utilize, pipelines, and then we can just like have a train, like, backwards and forwards on the, on the border. That's definitely, uh, that's definitely an option. Anything else sort of further up here? Is this literally... Oh, this is literally a road customs house. Okay, that's cool. Road customs house over there. And then... Another road customs house over there. Okay, there is actually... Is there is actually, like, no... Are there any railway connections on the Soviet side? Is there a single... I don't know... I don't know if there's a single railway connection in and out of the, the Soviet area. Oh my god. There's one. There's one. There's two. Oh, there's a big one here. Okay, 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 okay. Ooh. Oh, okay, all right. So, yeah, that's definitely, that's definitely interesting over there. That's good. Anything else? Anything else over here? No, 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 no. There is a train route there. I think that might sell, but there's not actually a train bridge. Okay, that's just noteworthy. Dude, I I freaking I freaking love this. I freaking love this map. Okay, but anyway, sort of concentrating our efforts down here seems to be uh, a good a good sort of plan. So, uh, I think the order of operations. I think the order of operations in terms of what we need to do uh, is as follows. 
I would like to keep most of what Bratislava looks like at the moment. Um, I don't know what the population sort of is. Um, we can always stick down a... We can always stick down a uh, city accounting office to get the to get the specific details. I'm not that bothered. I mean, we've got 35,000 workers sort of in uh, in the entirety of the country. That's fine, I think, to to work with at the moment. Let's maybe see if we can try and upgrade the facilities in Bratislava, and then we'll maybe be able to train people out to the oil fields, the oil fields over here, and then maybe train the oil back. I mean, the only problem is, is that if we're going to be training to the NATO border, I mean, we don't have to train to the NATO border. We could always, we could always just, we could always train it to the Soviet border. I say it's fine. I say it's fine, not because the number is low. It's because I'm going to have to move them all manually. <laughs> that's that's what I... That, so the numbers are offset by the fact that there's a tremendous amount of manual labor required in order to move everybody into accommodation. Right. Uh, okay, so I think we want to set... I think we want to set a construction office up or some form of construction office. Um, I am thinking... I'm thinking that maybe this area over here becomes becomes a construction office, um, at least some sort of form of uh, construction facility. Let's have a little look. Construction offices. I need to get a modded construction office. We do get a free construction office, but I don't particularly I don't particularly care about that. Let's go modded office. Da, 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 da. Construction office. There we go. Okay, I've got a big construction office. I would like to get a big construction office down. Uh, let's build this. Let's build this over here. Construction office doesn't need to go near the border, but I want it to sort of be all in this same sort of vicinity because this is where we're going to have all of our all of our imports. Uh, so we'll get the construction office. Let's uh, turn off auto build for now, just so that we can plan things out. So we'll get that over there. We'll get ourselves uh, aggregate storage for gravel. Uh, what am I looking for? storage. They've changed the menu and I still, I'm not sure that I actually really rate it, but hey-ho. We can get a free aggregate storage, actually. Do I care about a free aggregate storage? I mean, I might as well. Might as well take advantage of that. Sure. Okay, so that's looking good. That's nice. What else are we going to need? We're going to need a whole bunch of whole bunch of things. Uh, we need to get the bus stop or a train station in the center of town. I think we immediately want to go for trains. I really actually am making a concerted effort to start making uh, making money. Yeah, we need to think about where the, we need to think about where the, where the railways are going to go. I think maybe, I think maybe we plan for the railways to go like straight across and then we bulldoze this little tiny crappy little neighborhood, um, bring a train right through it and then we can sort of branch from there. You know, we can go up here or down here. I think that's, I think that's probably the best sort of option. So I think we're going to try and expand Bratislava. We're going to try and redo the sort of center a little bit. Uh, and we're probably going to expand out this way along the the one major sort of highway. What do we think about that? What do we think about that for for planning? I think that sounds, I think that sounds pretty good. Uh, there is a bit of an inconvenient mountain in the way, but I think that should be okay. Uh, speaking of inconvenient mountains, let's see if we can try and nab ourselves a train station. I would like. Oh yeah, I forgot metro stations. Are metro stations worth it, chat? I don't think I've ever actually experimented with uh, with metro stations. I mean, wow. Is it, do we just literally like immediately plonk down a metro station? To be honest, I'm kind of digging it. That's actually cool as heck. I really have not experimented with this at all. Dude, this is so legit. Okay, what if we, what if we like, plan to put a metro station there? Because a metro station is literally just, like, it's a regular old track, right? Uh, build metro railway. Yeah, we would have to go into underground view, and then... How do we do this? I've literally never, I've literally never built these before. We, we've got us we've got the metro railway, right? Do we need a very, do we need a specific... 
do we need a specific track? I mean, we've got we've got 10 million rubles, right? We've got 10 million rubles, and I really want to make sure that we we try and uh, must metro tunnel. Ah, okay, we need a tunnel. Metro tunnel. Yeah, okay. The, the problem with that is that are we going to be able to come out? Are we going to be able to come out here? Can we come out? Yeah, we can come out. How much would that actually end up costing us? How much would that end up costing us? Just out of curiosity. Literally, I've never experimented with Metro before. Sure, start construction. How much is that going to set me back? That's 120,000 rubles. I'm not joking, chat. That actually seems like a great deal. Maybe I'm just going bananas, but that seems... That seems like pretty decent. That seems pretty good. That seems pretty good. I kind of dig it. I kind of dig it, to be honest. And what about connecting? Can we connect? No, we have to connect specific metro. We have to connect specific metro line on. Hmm. Maybe for that, maybe for that reason, maybe for that reason, we stick with the old, uh, the good old, the good old regular railway in the first instance. All right, delete that too. Yeah, I'm definitely going to return to the metro, but for now, let's just stick with a regular old, uh, a regular old railway. This area, I'm going to demolish in its entirety, but for now, let's just get our, uh, let's get our, uh, train station down here. Train platform, excellent. Let's get it down. Somewhere like that. Okay, so train station's going to be there. We're going to expand out here. That's fine. These houses are going to get destroyed. Let's nab ourselves some uh, some tall residential buildings. Yep, I would like some 21-story prefabs, please. And if we can start migrating people, if we can start migrating like all of the all of the people into that, then that would be great. Let's return and get ourselves let's return and get ourselves the rest of the stuff that we need over here. Right. Uh, actual tram tracks in the game, and trams can use both railway tracks. Did I use them? I think I've used them before. I think I've used them before, but it was... It was very briefly. Right, let's get this here. This here. I love the way that roads now... Look and feel a million times better than they did. I mean, I've been playing this game. I was thinking about this the other day. I've been playing this game for such a bleeding long time. I mean, it's flipping great, don't get me wrong, but my goodness gracious me, it's a totally different game. It's a totally different game now than what it was uh, at the very start. Also, yeah, do we want to... Do we want to do anything with this river? I did say that there was no, like, water mechanics in this game. To be fair, there's not. This is a pretty... No offense to... No offense to anyone, anyone out there from Slovakia, but this is a pretty lackluster river. Y'all gotta do better on your, your river. Your river fronts. Yeah. Pretty, pretty disappointing. Also, pedestrian overpasses. I mean, what the heck? What the heck is that? What the heck is that? River is going to be good for sewage disposal. I mean, <laughs> I completely, you know what? You say that. Uh, the irony is that I completely forgot that I needed to even worry about water and sewage and stuff. I can't believe that. I can't believe that you have to do that now. Like, it's crazy. You have to do everything for these gosh darn people. Uh, right, so what do we got? We got this. Let's get that built. We're gonna fund that with rubles. That's obviously gonna get funded for, like, nothing. Um, it's free, actually, to build. Uh, unpause. Brilliant. Uh, what do I want to buy? What do I want to buy here? I think we just want gravel, right? We literally just want gravel. Let's purchase that with... Rubles? Yeah, I guess we purchase... I guess we purchase, uh... I guess we purchase gravel. Sure. Metro is better than sewage? I mean, yeah. Um, I guess, but sewage disposal, unfortunately, is mandatory, whereas the, the metro is only, is only, is only optional. All right, we'll auto-purchase this. Price for resources, price with delivery. is three rubles to transport it, like, I don't know, like 15 in-game meters. It's a bit of a, it's a bit of an exp- I mean, it all adds up, don't get me wrong, but for now, it'll, it'll be fine. All right, so construction office over here, that's good, that's very, very good. I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, I'm pretty happy with this. That's looking fine. We will get... 
We'll get this all sorted. Let's let's wait until this is constructed first, and then we will see exactly what we need. Remember, we need to provide all of the different bits and bobs for uh, for people. Also, I'm gonna immediately build electrified railway. I mean, I've 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 played this game a lot, and let's be brutally honest, I never learned my lesson, um, which is hard to believe because. I'm such an experienced strategy game player. That's sarcasm, in case anybody is wondering. Um, yeah. I am going to go electric straight away, because otherwise I'm going to end up with trains that are just miserable, and it's all going to be awful, and so I don't want to deal with that at all. Now, I am going to have to go through this mountain, am I? Like, I'm, I'm like 90% sure we're going to have to go through this mountain. But I'm going to try and do it in as tasteful a way as possible. Let's have a little look at the topographical map. This is a lovely, this is a lovely bit of area to build a city, by the way. Am I going to double it up? I am going to double it up. I am going to double it up. That's how bold, that's how bold I'm going to be, chat. That's how bold I'm going to be. Uh, yep. Except you're going to come out of there. Oops. You're going to come out of there. And for now, we're going to bring you across the road. And then we're going to bring you back this way. Okay. Not all of this is going to get built immediately. Don't worry. We're not going to, we're not going to end up going bankrupt by just building... By just building loads and loads of railway as much as I would like to. We're gonna take it easy. Too sharp of a turn? That's okay. That's fine. Okay, that's looking that's looking pretty decent. We will start construction of infrastructure there. Maybe we want to get a cheeky railway construction office. Maybe. But that's a problem for a future potato. Not me. Okay, let's connect this up with Dirt Road for now, if we can. We can't, that's okay. We're just gonna have to... Nobody lives here. Demolish the house then. Why would it even exist? Why would it even exist? Electric trains at the start is a hard move. I mean, it is and it isn't, right? Like, it's it's a, it's a way better way of doing things. Is there an electricity connection point over here? There absolutely is. It absolutely is. Railroads and um, railway building looks really snappy. Yeah, it's really, it's so much better. The fact that you can sort of tweak the curves, uh, you know, the... And you've got like curved, curved, uh, curved bridges and whatnot. It's it's flipping it's flipping cool. It's really really good. I I said that and then build a straight a straight uh, a straight bridge, but that's fine. Right. Okay. So construction office. Let's let's work through the let's work through these things here. Right. So workers are going to be pick upable. Uh, I think we'll actually just pick them up at the railway station for now. So we'll plan for that. Asphalt. Getting an asphalt plant. Is that something that we want to get immediately? I actually think that I don't hate that idea. Tunnels are much better, bridges are much better, roads are much better. The way that the way that everything sort of just comes together at the start of the game certainly feels much much better to me. Um, yeah, let me let me have another look at just where the oil is. It's over here. It's literally it's literally in this sort of big area. Let's uh, let me put down. Let me put down a marker just so that I have a, a rough, um, let me put down a rough marker of exactly where we're, exactly where we're, uh, we're going to be operating. I am looking for fossil fuels, pump jack. We're going to be doing large pump, pump, uh, pump wells, but we'll sort of sketch out exactly where things are going to go. Right. That's looking very lame. It's fine. Okay, there's some good quality sources here. I'm just finding it difficult to, to find them. Go. Oh, there we go. Beautiful. Again, like these are gonna be built sequentially. Don't worry. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna bankrupt myself by just building a whole bunch of oil wells. We're gonna we're gonna build them very slowly and carefully. And we're gonna build the best ones first. Or we're gonna try to. Why not build a power plant first? Because power is so cheap. Power is like, it's it's like one of the cheapest resources in the game. It is so unbelievably cheap. 
it's gonna it's gonna cost us a little bit to get the electricity uh, pumped through, and we might end up having to actually get the NATO stuff, NATO power. But most of our power will be will be Soviet. And actually, we have a modded we have a modded thing in the game, which allows us to do which allows us to do power with oil, I believe, or power with bitumen. Don't don't hold me to that, but I do think that that is the case. So. Uh, yeah, we'll do this. We'll have the refinery somewhat out of town, like over here. I'm kind of envisioning. That's my plan anyway. We have got, you know, the opportunity to ship people out of town on the train, which is great. We're not going to go too far. There's no real reason to do so. And then we have the opportunity to either... We have the opportunity to either connect to a... Uh, to either a NATO customs house via rail uh, with the oil, or we have the opportunity to perhaps deliver it over here. We're probably going to have to go to both areas. Uh, hey, Rekai, how's it going? Usually starting with power and selling is an easy way for an early income stream. Yeah, that's true. Tourism too. I actually rate tourism. Tourism is a lovely little thing you can do just to get like a few extra bucks at the start of the game. It's so easy. Does this game get many updates? Yes. This game is updated more regularly than I can count. And uh, this game is this game receives substantial updates, like at every occasion. It really is remarkable uh, how active the developer is. Right, let's have a little look. New mods, there's new mods, there's new there's new stuff all the flipping time. It's such a great game. It really, really is. Right, let's get a regular size train platform. Let's build it like over here. Now, this is gonna be our first. This is gonna be our first area, chat, where we're gonna need a name. We're gonna need a name. We're gonna need a name. It did get taken down a while ago, uh, but I believe that it is all back up now. So you should be able to. You should be able to play it. You should be able to play it and buy it. Well, I suppose you were always able to play it, but now you're able to buy it too. Right. Wodka Grant? Hey, that's a. That's a. That is a great suggestion uh, for when we actually start producing alcohol. That's probably not going to work, is it? I don't think so. Yeah, that's a great suggestion for when we start producing alcohol. Uh, but unfortunately, this is going to be this is going to be oil. Yes, we need town names. We need lots of town names, and we need lots of. How is that too sharp of a curve? We need lots of town names. We need lots of suggestions for all the different sort of industrial areas that we're going to be... That we're going to be working on. Petrograd? Petrograd is actually like a really great name. I like that a lot. Okay, so this is looking this is looking pretty decent, I feel. It's not bad. If we are going to get a railway construction office, I feel like a railway construction office right over here would be good. We're going to need to get a... What do you call it? A... Um, a... I want to say catalytic converter, but it's not a catalytic converter because that's an exhaust pipe on a car. We need a charging station. What's it called? Not a... What's it called, chat? I can't remember what it's called. A railroad electric connection. There we go. That's what we're going to need. Is that going to squeeze in there? No way. This is presumably going to be too close. I knew it was going to be too close. In my heart of hearts, I knew it was going to be a little a little tight. Okay. Now, I don't need real names. I need I need like imaginary I need imaginary fake names. I need imaginary imaginary names. I need like uh, let me have a look. Okay, so Petrograd, uh Oilo Oilo Slovakia. I like that one actually. I like that. That pays homage to the fact that we are here. Petrograd is good. I like Petrograd. Krasendor, Stalingrad, Leningrad, Murmansk. Now we need we need re we need like uh, we need like we need fake ones, you know? We need fake ones. We need like I like I like Oilo Slovakia. I like Petrograd too. I wonder if maybe we can get maybe we can deploy them both. Oilo Slovakia can be our extraction area, right? Why not? Why the heck not? Let's freaking go. Oilo Slovakia. Is that it? Is that how we spell it? Oilo Slovakia. Excellent. Okay. And then we'll get Petrograd over here. I like this. Uh, Nef Neftyugansk. I 
do speak a little bit of Russian, actually. <laughs> not, 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 uh, not meaning to brag. Uh, but I am not very good with my vocab. Uh, so there we go. Uh, what, am I, what am I typing here? I'm typing Petrograd. Petrograd. There we go. Okay. Uh, so let's zone the refinery. I really would like to zone the refinery. I'm trying to work backwards here from, like, where we're making money, chat. That's what I'm trying to do. I know that it's a bit scatterbrained, but, you know, at the start of a playthrough like this, you need to do your due diligence and you need to get all the important stuff down. You need to get it all sorted before you, before you unpause properly. Right, so oil refinery. We've got a delayed coker. Uh, we've got a biofuel plant. We've got a small refinery. And we've got a petrochemical combine, which... Produces petrochemical combine. Is that a better ratio? That's a way better ratio, right? I mean, it's a bit cheaty because it is a... Because uh... it's a modded building. Hold on. Is there a catch? What's the catch for this one, chat? What's the catch? I'm not spotting it. Consumption at maximum production. 150 tons of oil. Gives me 100 tons of fuel. Pollution is very high. Is that is that it? Is that it? Can you check the range? I can try. Yeah. Let me... Um, maximum water consumption is 6.5 per day. 54 megawatts versus 12 megawatts. Hey, that's a good spot. That's a bloody good spot that is. It is way more. Pollution is basically double. Power consumption is basically double. Maximum daily water consumption is actually less. Stations for vehicle unloading is basically less. It also takes a little bit more to build. I feel like there's... I feel like it's probably fairly well balanced, though. I don't, I don't think I've actually... I don't think I've actually used this one. So let's let's go for it. Let's go for it. So we we have inputs, we have outputs. Let's see how let's see how this ends up working. Um, also, what the heck is the steam there for? I need to also build. I need to build with scalability in mind. Let's build. Uh, oh, I need to get. Hold on. Let me get some uh, some of these. Looks like we'll need a cooling tower. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Like, there is steam there, but uh, there's a steam input and a steam output. But that's fine. Uh, we can we can easily do that. Right, what do I need? I need um, excavator. Let's get... We're not going to use nuclear excavators. Not yet, anyway. My tolerance isn't... Isn't that low. Bulldozer-wise... Uh, that's new. New-ish, I, I think. Right, are we within range? I think we should be within range. I think we definitely should be. Uh, there we go. Fossil fuels, boom, boom, boom. Okay, so yeah, cooling tower. If a cooling tower is needed, then that's fine. Let's let's draw this up. We'll do something like that, and we'll do. Something like that. Obviously, we're going to trash this because we don't need we don't need a connection there. But I think this should be fine. I think this should be fine. This actually gives us the space for a third one. That's how, chat. Like I'm 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 mega in on the old, on the old oil situation. Like we're we're here. Okay, uh, so that's good. That's looking that's looking really really nice. That's going to be where the first the first sort of root of people go. Uh, the first sort of workers. Let's return to the stuff over here and let's get ourselves all of the basic sort of infrastructure that we need. Uh, shopping center, I think we're just going to go with a small shopping center. Maybe crack this down in the center here. Yep, I think right about there. We'll nab ourselves a pub in this sort of same vicinity too. Make sure that we leave enough space for some walkways. Although, that being said, like we can always do... Uh, underground walkways. Going to deliver oil by truck? Um, no, the oil... Oops. The oil will be... The oil will be delivered by... The oil will be delivered by pipeline, and then it's going to be pumped out. It's going to be pumped out by pipeline. It's going to be pumped out by pipeline. 
But the real question after that is how do we want to handle it? That's the real question. Um, delivering oil by truck, I think, is... It might it might barely be economical. Like, it might actually barely work, but, like, I'm 90% sure that it doesn't, so I feel like I, I don't want to experiment with it. Underground pipes. I have experimented very, very briefly with underground pipes. I have not, I have not played around with them a lot. Uh, we can get a dinky cinema here, which is not going to fit, so we're going to have to get it over here, uh, or somewhere. Sure, stick it over here. That's fine. Hey, Dreamy Card, how you doing? How you doing? Let's do that over there. Bump that in there. Sure, that'll do. You know what? We'll use dirt paths for now. That's, that's okay. That's not a problem at all. Right, uh, so, going back through these, what do we got? Oh yeah, asphalt, concrete, steel. I tell you what, let's get the, um, let's get the, the basics done. Fire station, heliport, yes. Fire, since the store cannot be reached by footpath. No, don't worry, the, the, sorry, I should have explained when I put it down. The, um, this, the, there will be a path, there will be a, a road here. In fact, nobody lives here. Delete it. Delete it. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Building is in the way. Despawn. 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 Des there we go. Thank you. Okay. We should... Be able to get that in there. Perfect. Okay. So that's gonna be... That's gonna be nice. That's gonna be fine. Let's get ourselves... Let's get ourselves some other stuff. What did we... What did I say that we wanted? Oh, yeah. Um... Let's finish the citizen. Let's finish the citizen stuff first. Gallery of art. No. Unnecessary. Unnecessary. TV station. No. I'm not looking for that. I'm looking for state infrastructure. That's where it's kept now. We're going to get ourselves a small clinic. I guess that can go over here. Uh, and again, this the whole point of this is that we will be able to get a road in here somewhere. Okay, let's get this. In fact, you know what? Let's get let's get this entire area flattened. Then I can. Then I can hopefully make a better attempt at getting a getting a road through here. Okay. Hmm. Show me the show me the topographical map. Right. Well, these trucks are going slow. I got to be honest. I don't love that. I don't love that at all. Hey. Anybody live here? Yeah, somebody lives there, unfortunately. Okay, we will connect this up. It will maybe not be... Maybe it will be now. Okay, tuck it down. Nice. Okay, that's actually not looking... That's actually not looking too bad. So we'll get that up and running. That's good. Shame we can't tax the fires. I'd love to tax fires. I'd be the richest man alive. I mean, would, that would be what a what a great what a great idea. What am I looking for? I'm looking for this. We're looking for a fire station as well. We're looking for a fire station as well. Let's get the clinic down in the first instance. Okay, good. Get that flattened. Move it across a little bit. Small clinic. Uh, let's tuck it in a little closer. The indoor pool is the best unmodded sports facility. Yeah, I have a... Um, what's it called? I have the modded sports facility. Also, this can stay on the outskirts of town. The fire station, I'm not, I'm relaxed about being on the outskirts of town. In fact, over here is kind of nice. Sure. Fire station can go over there. Happy with that. Very, very happy with that. Uh, we will get ourselves... <laughs> Palace of the Soviet. No, not today. Well, yesterday, but not today. Uh, you can go somewhere later. I don't need to I don't need to deal with that. Secret police, prison, courthouse, police station. I haven't how, how necessary are all of these things? I mean, I know that they're necessary, but like how necessary, if you know what I mean. 
I mean, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what's difficult to understand about that. But how necessary are they? Uh, we'll zone a police station. Sure, what the heck? What the heck? We'll zone a police station. Okay. We don't need a city hall. Technical services. We will get technical services, but in true Orbit of Potato fashion, we won't get technical services until after we need them. So that's fine. Pollution monitoring station. You know what? I'm actually going to zone a pollution monitoring station. We're going to zone it like somewhere along here because it's probably going to be necessary to get at some point. Okay. So that's like the physical infrastructure, at least the, the building infrastructure. Uh, there is a bunch of stuff that we are also going to need. We're going to need a university. That's going to be necessary. Uh, but we're not going to worry about that right now. Tourism. Tourists. I don't care about tourists. I don't care about tourists even slightly. What I do care about is electricity. And high voltage substation. Holy cow. Hey, that's kind of cool. I didn't even realize that was a thing that we could get. Uh, this is like illegible here. I can't. I literally cannot see where I'm placing this down. Okay. Are we playing the game after the loyalty update? I... I genuinely cannot see where this is. have to hold shift. Um, we are playing the game on the latest test version, so this is this is as late as, as, as modern as it comes. God, I cannot... I can't see a bleeding thing. Right. Extend this. Extend this. Extend this. So the root of the railway is going to come, like, through here. That's going to be the root of the railway. Let's keep... Let's keep space... Let's keep space along this road, right? That's the plan. Then we need to go back and get electricity sorted. Do I want to get underground stuff? I feel like underground stuff is just like a recipe for disaster. Let's get a small substation over here. Get another small substation over here, maybe. That's good. Okay. I feel like this game might be playable on most, um, on most, uh, on most laptops and computers and stuff. I feel like it's not, it, it can get, like, very intensive later on, but, like, for the most part, it's fine. Uh, I think that electric substation is going to be all that we need to power this area. This area will probably power from a bespoke connection off to the edge right over there. That's fine. Right, so that's power. Probably enough power for now. Maybe not enough power for now, but but maybe maybe it will be. Uh, let's return to construction. Let's get ourselves. We don't need a construction office. Cement plant, concrete plant. I am gonna get a concrete plant. We're gonna import the stuff that we need to import for now. Let's build it here so that we have the capability to expand things later on. We'll also get an asphalt plant, which we will also import the ingredients for. Uh, we'll get that over there. Cool. That's fine. I think this is good. I think this is good. Chat, I need a name. I need a name for my construction area. I need a, I need a name for my construction area. Get thinking. Get thinking. Get thinking. Brick factory. Don't care about brick factory. Wood cutting post. Don't care about wood cutting post. That's fine. Uh, we are going to fund the construction of this. We are going to fund the construction of this. Uh, but we'll do that. We'll do that in a minute. What else do we need? What else do we need? Let's go through these. Let's go through these things. Oh, yeah. I completely forgot. I need a, um, I need a storage area. Uh, general cargo, storages, open storage. Open storage small is absolutely fine. But open storage free is even better. Heck yeah. Nice. Okay. Open storage. Let's go purchase resources. We're going to purchase steel. We're going to purchase prefabs, bricks, boards. And that's it, really. I don't think we need aluminium for anything. Aluminium isn't used in construction of any building. Correct me if I'm wrong, chat. I don't think it's used in any building's construction. I mean, I know it's used in um, airplane construction, but I don't think it's used in anything else. So we'll go for that. Nice. Okay. Vostyrnask. Uh, build, build it off ski. Build it. <laughs> erect, erect, erect construct a bad. I like construct a bad. You know what? Let's keep it. Let's keep it simple. Let's keep it simple. Construct a bad. Construct. Construct a bad. There we go. Okay. But thank you for the suggestions. That was that was some that was some quality. That was some quality. Uh, that was some quality suggestions there, chat. That was really good. Okay. Uh, mechanical components, electronic components. I will need those. Do I get a free one of these too? 
free aggregates. General cargo. Do I get a free... Do I get a free closed storage? May need aluminium for wires. Hmm. You might be right about that. You might be right about that. Hey, Chad, do I get a free... Do I get a free warehouse? Gas stations! Gas stations! Good shout! Good shout, I need gas stations. I don't think I get a... I don't think I get a free closed storage. Airport cargo terminal? No, that's not it. Yeah, I guess I'm just gonna have to fork out. I guess I'm just gonna have to fork out for a for a place to store my mechanical components. That's fine. I'm not I'm not worried about it. It doesn't matter. I'm not bitter or anything. What about a small barn? Free closed storage ain't a thing. Yeah, okay. Medium waterfront store. What about if I just store like my entire small warehouse? A small warehouse would be more appropriate. But a small barn is actually slightly better. Actually, that's not true. It's slightly worse. But it's also a bit of a meme. And I kind of love that I store all my... <laughs> all my most valuable components for this nation in a, in a small barn. How much is that going to cost? It's going to cost me like 3,000 rubles to build. We'll build that. Okay. Right. So, that's pretty much everything. I think that's... I think that's looking good. We need to get gas stations. I'm going to get gas stations right now. Gas stations, refueling... Gas station free. We got a free gas station. Huh. Hey, Alan. How you doing? Should we place down my free gas station? I'll place down my free gas station. I get 12 free gas stations? I get 12 freaking free gas stations? What the heck? Mr. Retromation. Hello. How's it going, my dude? Thank you very much for the little uh, dancing uh, person. I don't really know what I'm doing here on YouTube, as you can probably tell. Um, I have no idea what anything means. But your name appears at the top of the chat now, so that's kind of cool. Look at look at this guy, flexing his little gray verification tick. It's disgusting. It's absolutely disgusting. It makes me sick. No, but thank you. Thank you, amigo. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I really, I have no idea. I have no idea. I, I don't have alerts set up. I don't know how to, I don't know how things work. I really don't around here. Um, it's all a bit, it's all a bit mad. It's all a bit mad. Hold on. Can we get a gas station here? Oh, that's cheeky. Oh, that's a little, that's a little cheeky. Ooh, yeah. Look at that. Look at that. They're sticky. I suppose they stick around at the top of chat. That does make sense, I suppose. God, this is a very grim-looking gas station. That's really stretching the limit of what a gas station actually is. I mean, just because you put up some fences around, around a few, <laughs> a few tanks of gas, doesn't make it a gas station. Surely, surely not. Okay. Anyway, uh, that's that's it, right? I think that's everything. I think that's everything, with the exception of water and sewage and connecting the power up with wires. I think that's everything. I think we're going to unpause in just a second and we're going to build the stuff that we need to build immediately. So I'm thinking in terms of what we're going to purchase, I'm thinking the shopping center gets purchase. I'm thinking the pub gets purchase. We're going to connect up the uh, oh, heating as well. Oh my gosh, I forgot about heating. You're absolutely right. Although to be fair, that doesn't actually have to be done until, you know, my population are dying. Let's go here. You love to see it. You absolutely love to see it. You absolutely love to see it. Okay, it's a little bit of a dirt path, but it's fine. Let's connect up, um, connect up things around here. School, kindergarten. Mm, yeah, you only need those if you actually care about education. Do I care about education? Unfortunately, uh, you actually kind of have to care about education because otherwise, uh, you're screwed. <laughs> there's no other way to put it. Um, there's no other way to put it. Can I get... Can I get any of the... Are any of these buildings not lived in? Oh my god. I can't wait until we can... I can't wait, wait until we can destroy like all of the historical elements of this city and turn it into another faceless Soviet scape. God, that is an ugly path. I mean, oh my lordy, that is an ugly path. 
the central committee did not approve did not approve construction of that one no comrade no they did not oh my lordy okay okay we built that we built that that's good we build this build that build that build that build the police station build that don't need to build that yet build that build is that it i'm almost certain that we're going to need more uh more of these substation things fire station fire station's optional i mean we only need a fire station when there's a fire right so i mean like why not save a few pennies and just just wait until there's a fire <laughs> That's that's the true Scotsman in me talking. That really is that really is so cheap. <laughs> and yeah, we've we've paid to build the we've paid to build the police station, but we haven't paid to build the road in front of them. So I mean, <laughs> it's gonna be a very ineffective police station. Right. Okay. Uh, let's buy the let's buy the trucks. Oh yeah, we need to fund we need to fund this the concrete plant. We need to fund that the asphalt plant. Get that in there. What what do we reckon the best ratio is here, chap, for buildings? I feel like, I feel like we'll get a few buses. This? Are we going to get this bus? Are we going to get Zill bus? Maybe we don't get this bus, and instead we, we get Zill bus. Um... I mean, it's six and a half a dozen. The Lux, I, I usually, I usually go for the Lux, I think. I usually go for the Lux. Skoda. This one, the SKD. Is that Slovakian? That's a Slovakian car, right? So I feel like maybe we, you know, we, we do that. Is it, is it a Slovakian car? I don't know. I don't know. Let's go, let's go for a few of these. Let's go for, let's go for three. Let's go for three. Let's go for three. We're fine with bulldozers. We're fine for buses. Concrete mixers. We'll get four. Covered hull trucks. There's no reason to get more than just a few. Uh, one, two, three. That's fine. Dumpers. We'll get a lot of dumpers. Do I want to get a Maz dumper? I feel like a Maz dumper is not a bad is not a bad thing to get. I really I like the I like these I like these as an investment. I mean, to be fair, I could probably have bought the... What is it? Um... Open hull. The open hull Maz. Yeah, but if we get a if we get a Maz dumper, I feel like that's going to be good. Is this game like playing City Skylines? It's like playing City Skylines, except everything is about a billion times more granular. But it's also about a billion times more rewarding for what you do. That's the thing about this game that makes it so satisfying, is that... It's really, really complex. It's really, really in-depth. But man, when you have a functioning economy that is like completely ticking and it's all just like, it's all just like working. You got all the delivery routes, everything works and it plays well. There is just nothing like it. Right. I'm doing it. I'm buying four of these Maz trucks. Excavators. We've got excavators already. Feld tree capacity. Who cares? Open hull. We'll buy two of these. Paver. We'll buy one. Personal car, zero. Road cranes. We will actually buy a few road cranes. Rollers, we'll buy one. Tower cranes, we'll buy two. Probably going to need more Maz trucks than that. That leaves us six slots or so. I feel like that's kind of okay. I feel like that's kind of okay. I'm kind of content with that, all things considered. That's not too bad. Right. Are we ready to go? I think we might be ready to go. I haven't set up any sort of construction over here. That's fine. This area, I want to try and... I mean, I'll probably end up buying one of these. And then we'll wait for the other one to get built. But we'll at least let the game do a little bit of... A little bit of construction, shall we? A barn is going to be built. Okay. Right, chat. Place in... Place, um... Place in the chat how much how much money you think I've committed. So we got six and a half million. Just, just six point... Uh, nine point six five million at the moment. What on earth do you think I'm going to be at when I unpause? At least $5? I would wager a few more than $5, but it's also not dollars that we're paying for it in, so 
I think I'm going to have exactly the same number of dollars at the end here. Also, uh, whilst you determine that, chat, whilst you determine that, chat, I'm going to tweak the music ever so slightly. Uh, and then I am also going to buy a step-down, what do you call it, uh, transformer thing, high-voltage transformer. This one. Yeah, we'll, we'll get this one. And we'll get it over here. Perfect. Yeah. Good. Very, very important. Six million? No. It's going to cost me like 200k. I, it's not going to cost me that much. I think I'll have plenty of money left. Uh, let's immediately go for the big wires. Build that. How much is that going to cost me? 3,500 rubles? That's nothing. Will I play the full version when it comes out? You mean, well, you mean the um, when it comes out on release, will I play the realistic mode? Potentially, but realistic mode, as I was saying earlier, it scares the living bejesus out of me. And also, um, I really don't think it's possible to do to do a series of this. As much as it really like sucks to say, I, th I think it, I think doing a series of this game on YouTube uh, is somewhat impossible in 2023. go get that through over there right that's looking good let's get this over here can i combine these actually no, i probably best just keep them as their own their own little thing yeah i realistic mode is realistic mode is is definitely something that i'm interested in checking out but it's not something that I'm actively looking at checking out. Okay. There we go. That is a very, very long stretch of wire. Okay. That's good. That's two out of the three done. Let's get this last bit. Let's bring it all the way out here. And then... All the way down here. This could be... This could be done so much better. I hate it already. I hate it already. But you know what? I'm actually okay with it. Uh, let's get one of these over here. Let's fix the road up before I produce any more... Spam. Wire spam. And let's grab ourselves one more wire just to connect this up. Doesn't even need to be a good wire, just a bad wire. Miniature wire, that's fine. Okay, let's fund all of these and let's see what it... Let's see what it does. Let's see what it does. Okay, let us prepare for the damage, ladies and gentlemen. It begins. It begins right now. Okay. What is life without a little bit of spaghetti? That's what I always ask. That's what I always ask. Okay, let's see. Let's see what this. Let's see what this brings for us. So, um, what I need to do is I also need to link up everything here. So we need to select sources. Uh, asphalt plant we can't do yet. Steel we can do over here. Prefab panels. Yep. Boards. Oops. There we go. Uh, mechanical components. We're gonna set up to buy mechanical components to our farm because of course. Of course we are. <laughs> it's literally to our barn. Excellent. So this highly important barn is going to be where we store all of our good stuff. Okay, nice. Uh, petrol stations, I believe, are, are set up to auto order. I believe. Yeah, I think they are. Although I will need to build that road. 1,300 rubles. That's a bit, a bit expensive. A bit expensive. Okay. Um, oh, look at this. We're working. We're working. We got a shopping center. I haven't set up water or sewage yet, have I? Gosh darn it, I haven't. I keep forgetting about that. Right, let's get this Let's get this done. Let's get power done. Beautiful. Get that substation done. Build these wires. Build these wires. Well, whatever this costs, it's definitely worth, worth doing it. And get that. 1,700 rubles. Okay. The entirety of the town should now be completely electrified. We should start to see a few trucks start to uh, start to assemble over here. We're gonna turn. 
we're going to pause construction of this building because we don't actually need to see it uh, happen. Okay, that's not important right now. What's important, what's important for the for the construction office to build is, yeah, we want it to build all these little bits of road. The green highlighted bits of road, that's probably the only thing that I really care about right now. Uh, although we also probably want this to be built. This train station. Yeah, so we'll, we'll add that to the production queue, or it will be added automatically. That's fine. And we'll see what happens there. Number of sellers. We got a lot of sellers at the shopping center. We got a lot of people at the pub. That's all looking good. Um, we do need to get a church. Church is nice. We're not going to ditch the church. The church is actually legit. This is why I like starting in... Uh, starting in old towns. Can we get a thing through here? Oh, come on. Because you get churches, and the churches are actually so good. This is never going to work, is it? Okay, so this house is going to have to go at some point in the future. Okay, that's that's fine. That's fine, but we don't have to deal with it. We don't have to deal with it for now. We just have to bear it in mind for later. Okay, the good thing is everything is looking great. Now, here comes the here comes the bit that I'm a little bit less um, au fait with, shall we say. Uh, heating is easy. We can deal with heating. We can deal with heating later as long as we don't pollute the entire flipping town, which is actually something that I'm very, very liable to do, but that's fine. Plumbing. Plumbing, plumbing, plumbing. So, we need... We need to get sewage. Sewage first. Um, I think maybe two sewage tanks is probably fine. But, I mean, this is, this is coming from a guy who knows absolutely nothing about plumbing. Let's... Let's put a... Put a... Put a plumbing state. Put a plumbing station? Is that what... A sewage tank? Put a sewage tank in there. Okay, we get a sewage tank over there. We get a sewage tank over here. God, so much. There's literally so much on this screen right now. I can't see. Okay, that goes there. That's fine. Okay, good. Let's pause again. Pause again. Pause again. Underpass walkway. Yeah. Ooh, an underpass walkway. I keep forgetting that those actually exist. I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting. Right. Let's get a... We'll do that. We'll do that, but we'll do it later. Uh, let's get a small water well over here somewhere. This seems like a legit place to do it. The water quality is at 94%. Is it within walking distance of some jobs? I presume so. Build a water tower, then connect it to a plumbing station, then auto-purchase the water. Is that something that you can do? Can you auto-purchase water? Really? I thought you needed a water... Is that actually something that you can do? Like, seriously? Okay, okay well, that... That is very intriguing. That is very, very intriguing. However, I actually feel like I would kind of benef benefit from doing it myself. I'm actually going to do it myself, even though I am going to experiment with that. I am definitely going to experiment with that. Okay. They need 99% water. Yeah, we need to get a water treatment. I think a water treatment plant small will be fine for me here. There we go. Yeah, I know. I know. We need, I know we need treatment. I know we need treatment. I know we need treatment. And then we need to go to... Ah, I've never, I've never bought water. I've never bought water from the, oh yeah, there it is. I've literally never bought water ever at any point from the, from the border. I've never, I've never tried that. I am very, very interested in checking it out. Now, do I need to get a water pumping station between the pump and the treatment center? I think I do, don't I? I think I do. Let me, um, let me place the, what is it called? The water outlet. Yeah, I, I think I, yeah, I definitely do. Sure. That'll be fine there. It doesn't need to be manned. It doesn't need to be operated though, so that's so that's nice. Water substation. Yeah, we'll get a water substation or two. Similar place to the sewage substation. Yeah, water substation in there. That's good. Sewage substation. Uh sorry, another water substation. Next the police station. The water sub you've got the water substation and you've got the police substation. There we go. Uh, do you need to build new towns, or can you build one city in a whole map? 
whatever you want. Whatever you want. You can you can have one sort of like mega city or you could build like multiple smaller cities. I did a whole series on Works and Resources Soviet Republic, which demonstrates probably quite well. I mean, the game is like has changed pretty significantly since the, the nuclear update, um, you know, because water and stuff didn't exist back then. But um, but that uh, that was an example of when I built like a whole bunch of different cities, which supplied basically each city had its own sort of population center and they supplied their own little sort of industry, which I think is probably what most people do. Most people have like an iron mining town and a, you know, a chemical processing town and a, you know, a, another town and another town for different sort of specific purposes. You can really do whatever you want. It's kind of great. Okay, let's get a big water pipe. Big water pipe. Can I... I need to go underground. Oops. Yeah, I need to go underground. Cool. That's sewage pipe. See, I'm just... I'm new to this. I'm new to this whole world. I'm new to this whole world. Right. That goes over there. Let's try with just one for now. Keep it big. No reason to... No reason to go small. And then let's get a big pipe over to here. Do we need to put a pumping station in between water treatment and water distribution? I don't think we do. I don't think we do, do we, chat? I think it. I think it's just the pumping station between the treatment plant and the, the water treatment. Although, if I do need to throw it in again, then we can do that. A water tower is storage. I can do a water tower is storage. I should? Okay. If I should, then I will. I can put in another... I, I can put in another pump. Where is it? Uh, duh, 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 duh. We'll put in another big pumping station. How about that? Okay. Go. Water tower. Should we do a big water tower? It's the Chad water tower. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Do we need to put a... Do we need to put a... Let's... Can we squeeze it in over here? Oh, it's so close. It's so close to fitting in. In this little area. Oh, it would be nice if it... It would be nice if it fitted in there, but I guess we'll have to do it over here. Uh, yeah, do we need one between the water tower and the... Um... Yeah, I know the I know the pipes take the... I know the, the game takes the angle and the pipes into consideration. It matters specifically for sewage, right? Because then you have to, like, step it, step it up. God, that was a that was a that was a classic series. That really was a classic series. That is not video game. Video game. What the heck is going on here? Can we not? Yeah, there we go. That's fine. That's fine there. And then let's go here. Okay, this feels quite good. This feels quite good. And then we can go from here all the way over to here. Building is in the way. What's the building that's in the way? That looks fine, right? I think that should be okay. And then this can go over there. Let's see. Let's see if that works. Okay, it's a little bit higgledy-piggledy, but I feel like it should be fine. Let's queue it all up for uh, for construction starts, and maybe I will see if my stuff, uh, my trucks can do it. Alternatively, I probably shouldn't let my people just go that long without water, because knowing the speed of my trucks, um, it's probably going to take a little while. That was only 50% of what we needed to get done. Sewage is still super important. Okay. When you purchase border, uh, water from the border, they use less? They use less water if you purchase it from the border? That seems like legit, like entirely legit. Let's also get some sewage discharge over here. Uh, let's go back up above ground. Let's go here. Let's, let us, let us spew all of our, let's spew all of our waste uh, out towards the filthy capitalist pigs in Austria. That's right. That's right. Don't forget about pollution. Yeah, I'm... Maybe we do it over here. How... What's the sort of pollution radius? I don't want to treat any sewage. I'm, I'm not interested. I'm not interested in treating that sewage. I think we do it over here, right? 
Yeah, I think we do it over here. Sewage pump does not pollute. Hey, that's great. The sewage river dump pollutes a lot. Well, there's a bit of a contradiction there, um, but that's okay. I'm not particularly bothered. That's a-okay with me. Let's uh, let's see if we can try and get this. Let's see if we can try and get this sorted now. Uh, the river is going to be a bit of a problem, and also, yeah, we're going to need to step it probably down here at some point. Only the water, not the people. I don't care about the water. In fact, I don't care about the people either. See, I think... I think we're going to have an issue here. Okay, that looks fine. That looks fine. But the problem is... Yeah, it requires a proper slope. And I am not convinced we're going to be able to get a proper slope that actually necessarily works. Okay, that's fine. We're just going to have to put in a... What's it called? A minus 15... Minus 15 meter thing. A sewage pump. That's it. There we go. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, 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 I know. It's, 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 uh, I just wanted to see if we could try and do it without. Okay, how's that looking? I think that's looking fine. Well, we're gonna, we're gonna end up with a heck of a lot of poop piling up, so to speak. Yeah, it requires proper slope. We'll stick in a pumping station. We'll stick in another pumping station. Make sure that it's within range. Cool. Nice. Nice. Okay, I mean, it's not exactly the prettiest thing that you've ever seen, but it's a sewage network, for crying out loud. I mean, who really cares if it looks pretty or if it looks ugly? It's a sewage network. Okay, let's zone it. Let's build it. Let's get it done. Okay, let's uh, also flick back up to the top here, and let's see what happens. So, play underground. I need to build all this stuff manually. Um, I can do this with, what, what's it called? The, is it this one? Batch start construction. There we go. I knew it was that thing. Good. Okay, nice. And we'll go back up to the surface. And let's see how that works. Beautiful. Did that road start building? No, it didn't. That's good. So it just happened with the underground stuff. Right, we'll build the sewage discharge right here. We'll flick back to the undergrounds. Did... No. Oh, I needed to do batch, uh, batch start using rubles. There we go. That's more like it. No, I don't want to. I don't want to construct the. Uh, I don't want to construct that. Not quite yet. Okay, good. Good. Okay, back up top. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, so we spent about five hundred thousand rubles or so, give or take. I'm reasonably happy with that. This is looking good. Let's get the tower built. 14,000 rubles. That's a steal. Let's check underground. See if there's anything else we need to get. There's one more pipe. Looks like we didn't build. Let's get that built too. Substation. That's cool. Is that everything? I think that might be everything. Okay. Moment of truth. Let's see what happens when people start working here. Uh, do we need... Do we need to change the walking distance here? Nobody lives here. There's a few people that live here. That's fine. That's fine. Let's also uh, reduce this to zero because we do not need people wasting in, uh, wasting away in here. Why didn't you start in realistic mode? Because otherwise we would be here all night and I only have four hours. <laughs> so uh, without, without a little bit of starting capital, I'm afraid it would have taken a hell of a long time. <laughs> 
I'm also scared of realistic mode. I am terrified of the prospect. Right, how's this looking? Oh, we need to import chemicals, don't we? We're auto purchasing chemicals already, that's fine. Is there power here? There's no power here. Buildings without a power supply. Oh yeah, we're not actually importing power. Right, imports. Sure. There we go. Brilliant. Okay, so we are we are importing with uh with dollars, but to be honest, that is completely fine. We're processing, we've got water, that is great. If I have a little pause here, we can have a little look at Make a city? That's a button that I've not seen before. Uh, no, what am I looking for? I'm looking for building properties. Uh, not water, water pressure. How's that looking? Is that where all the water should be? Water quality is 99%. I think that's pretty good. Water flow is in a nice place. Yeah. That's looking pretty good. Sewage. Sewage flow, yeah, that's that's all fine. Although, is that going up? That's going down. Coming through here, coming out here, perfectly. Great. I think that's I think that's all showing is I think that's all showing is fine. Excellent. Well, I I'm very very happy with how that turned out. That's looking really really good. Okay, uh, hopefully nobody is going to end up leaving my town. I think we have managed to secure pretty much universal happiness. Pretty much universal happiness, which uh, is quite good, actually. Very, very good, in fact. Okay, uh, population 35,041. Remember that, chat. We don't want to end up, we don't want to end up uh, dropping below that number. Okay, so the next question is, the next question is, what's our next objective? I would love to hear some suggestions. We've got the opportunity to get uh, pretty much this entire, this entire uh, underpass to the shop. Oh yeah, we do need to get an underpass to the shop. Although that being said, I will just demolish one of these buildings at some point. It is going to happen. Wait, let's be, let's be fair. I mean, what is the walking distance anyway? Actually, the walking distance is fine. The walking distance is fine. I mean, people are just going onto the road and then walking along. And because that's one of the best roads in the country, <laughs> literally, <laughs> um, it's actually not taking too long. I think we maybe want to try and get... I think we maybe want to try and get the petrochemical plant set up. That would be really, really good. I'm interested in that. Uh, also getting this 21-story prefabricated flat. I mean, are there any parents... Or are there any kids living with their parents at the moment? No. So that's good. Uh, we're obviously in March, which is fine, which means that we don't need to worry about heat. Uh, construction is all just sort of happening, mostly presumably happening on, what, the road here? Oh, we don't need, just build that, that's fine. 127 rubles, you know what, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna moan about 127 rubles. Same over here, just get the, just get this all built this whole build. I actually don't care. I thought I did. I, I really don't. It's gonna take it's gonna take more time just to just to move over there. I I really don't need to I don't need to wait that long. I'd, I'd appreciate if the let's um lower this to zero. Number of workers outside CO. Nope. Nope. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that at all. Let the train platform, let the train platform be the sort of recipient of people that come and work here. We'll pump that up to like 20. Pump that up to like 20. Get the trucks to come and deliver over here. Let's check the construction office. Should literally be... Should literally be this. Although we've got a few other a few other roads that I'm going to auto-purchase uh, and just auto-complete. Okay, that's good. Let's get the train platform. Let's get the train platform worked on. That's going to be good. Once that is done, we can we can move ahead with uh, we can move ahead with this area over here. This looks like it's out with the construction office range, but that's because I haven't cranked up the construction office range yet. If we bump this up to three thousand to three thousand meters, then I'm sure we would manage to squeeze that in. 
Yeah, I'm not super bothered about that, though. Population has gone down ever so slightly. But, like, nothing, nothing major. Nothing major for now. Uh, yeah, so... What about this population over here? Do I care about this population? I'm not sure that I do. I'm not sure that I do. Uh, we are going to need to get at least one train load worth of worth of oil outputs to the customs house over here. That's the only thing that we need to do in order to level off our our dollar production. Then we can maybe start thinking about power, local power production. That would be cool. We've got a couple of different options with that. Nuclear is obviously the very sexy one, but uh, frankly, I'm not sure. I'm not sure we could manage that. Right. How's this looking? 19, 19 things of gravel. Uh, we need to get a we need to get the concrete plant and the asphalt plant up and running, and I'd forgotten about that. We need to get a we need to get a bus. We need to get a bus. Do we even have a place for a bus stop here? I kind of envisioned the train platform. Kind of envisioned. Kind of envisioned the train, the train platform just being the be-all and end-all sort of pick-up points and drop-off points. Hmm. There's a few options here. Maybe I just, maybe I just stop faffing around and build a bus stop. It just feels it feels somewhat defeatist. Is there a free bus stop actually? Do we get a free bus stop? <gasps> we get a free bus stop. We get, literally get a free bus stop. Oh my lordy, that's so good. That's so good. I love I love this. I love this. I love this. I love this. Uh, sure. We get up to fifteen free bus stops. Hey, that's great because we're gonna delete it as well. It's not free because we had to build a road for three hundred thirty nine rubles, but I don't care. What if you use the train platform as a main point, but connect railway to roads, lay down tram tracks, and use trams with mixed railroad operations? Yes. Well, I mean, that is... That is the dream. Platform terminal is full. What are you talking about? Platform terminal is full. Don't be daft. Uh, can we also get a bus depot? We can also get a bus depot, right? In a bus depot, we can get a free bus depot. Or a free depot thing. What's it called? Not a bus platform. Depot. Road depot. Free! Oh, man. I love how you get free things. It's so good. Okay, get that. Buy a bus. 52? No. No, 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 no. Let's get the Lux. Let's get the Lux. We'll do here, to here, to here. Sure. I actually legitimately don't think that I care more than that. Uh, don't... Don't allow anybody but workers. Don't allow anybody but workers, and you can go and fill up over there. Okay, so that is construction sort of taken care of. And in fact, what am I doing? I should just, I should change this. I don't need um, view line in detail. I don't need, uh, I don't need this. I can just get a free bus. I can get a free bus stop. I don't know why I'm like so averse to a free bus stop. We can always just delete it later, right? And besides, people can walk. People can walk to the... People can walk to work. What's a little bit of exercise? What's a little bit of exercise gonna do? It's fine, right? It's a very... It's a very angular walkway. But that's okay. We like angular walkways. Okay, let's... Uh, add... This is a bus stop. Can I... Hold on. Ditch this as a stop. Ditch this as a stop. And there we go. Okay. I think... I think that's the line. I think that's the line. Okay. And then we can decide... We can decide exactly what the sort of ratio is between, you know, people going where. That is 53 people work, uh, waiting to, to work at that bus stop. That is an insanely large amount. To be honest, it really doesn't need to be that that many. We, we probably have slightly over-provisioned. We've slightly over-provisioned this. But that's okay. Uh, maybe I'll resume construction of this. If we resume construction of this area, then we can maybe start doing some... doing some work. There we go. Lovely to see. So, 
Let me see what we need for this. We need gravel. We need cement. Do I just import the water as well? Sure. For now, we'll do that. I just want to get this. I want to get this going. Gravel, bitumen. Sure. I mean, we are literally so close to the flipping border that I'm not even going to... I'm not even going to... I'm not even going to complain. Not even going to complain at all. Concrete, gravel, and asphalt. Buildings without drinking water. We can't export. That's fine. Building is without concrete export. That's also fine. Uh, although, you should be able to export, right? I mean, you don't need drinking water. Need a second uh, a second bus stop? I don't think we need a second bus stop. Oh, well, that being said, it's like, you should be able to... We should be able to go here. What's the issue? Why are you not... Plan is not assigned as a source? Oh, have I not assigned... Ah, there we go. I haven't assigned this as a source. There we go. Yeah, drinking water is a luxury that I can't afford. Not at this moment in time, anyway. Right, beautiful. Okay, that's us clicking into clicking into higher gear. Fantastic. And I tell you what, let's sign up this as the pickup point for workers. Look at this. We are mobilizing. It's this is this is what is so incredible about this game is that it all just sort of like goes. It just all it just all sort of happens. I'm wondering if it's possible to create a Soviet utopia in this game. Oh, it's possible, but I mean, I, I would say even at, even at its best, this game doesn't really deliver a utopia. I mean, you can build a grand and glorious palace of the Soviet, but that doesn't really doesn't really translate to utopia. Utopia is a very yeah, it's a strong a strong word. Okay, this is looking good though. This is looking really really good. There we go. We're actually constructing stuff. We are actually constructing. Good, 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 good. Okay. Uh, so, yeah. I think the next stage of production is probably going to be starting to work on... Well, we'll build that. We'll build that road. And then I think we're going to start... I'm going to manually assign this. Oh, it actually automatically... It actually automatically did it. Okay. Well, that's great. Well, that's going to mean that a whole bunch of stuff starts to, to mobilize, which is great. And you are presumably going to go to the petrochemical place. We may need a little bit more concrete capacity. But to be fair, it's all going to happen. It's all going to happen pretty rapidly. Yeah, we are losing a few people. Continue construction. There we go. We'll let that happen as well. We are losing a few people, but I'm not overly concerned about that. I presume it's just the fact that there is, like, far and away not enough work. Let's increase the number of people that can work here then, I suppose. Crank it up to 50, and we'll just let it all... We'll let it all go. Crank this up to something as well. You know, give people... Give people some meaning in their lives. We'll let them, you know... Let them work a little bit. Look at this fire station. This fire station is all... Is all built. Ooh, does the small clinic need an ambulance? That's a great shout. Um, I don't believe that there will be any... I don't believe that there will be any casualties yet, he says, as ambulances immediately scoot right out and start picking people up. And I think everything should be within walking distance. Most things are within walking distance. So that's... That's good enough healthcare as far as I'm concerned. So that's not too bad. This fire station is presumably going to be built pretty darn quickly. And we're also going to start building over here. This is great. This is great. Have I missed out any other buildings or anything like that? No. I think I should probably grab... Ah. Uh, are we having issues with filling speed? Yeah. Filling speed is an issue. Filling speed is an issue at these old at these older buildings. Yeah. Is there a comparable... Is there a way for me to compare filling speed? chat or is it just one is slow one is fast does it actually say I feel like I need to maybe for gravel specifically I feel like I need something else yeah Okay, 
at that. I mean, eight tons. It took years. It took years to fill up. It's a little bit faster for steel by the looks of things, but, like, not much. Hmm. Okay. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm just conscious of the fact that my population is dropping a little bit, and I think it's entirely due to the fact that we just don't have enough jobs. If I have a little look at population stats here. Um, unemployed. Unemployed workers, 25,000. Okay, that's not, <laughs> that's not actually super helpful because the workers, the workers are like literally everywhere uh, rather than just specifically here. I need to also grab a state, in, is it state infrastructure? Yeah, city hall slash accounting office. Should we get this over here? Sure. Why the heck not? I would really, really like uh, some additional insight into what's going on. I think I'm also going to purchase a few more... A few more of the dumpers as well. We've still got four four spare truck slots. Four spare truck slots, that should be fine. We need a few boards. That's good. Construction is coming along, that's great. Uh, the building panel before you build it lists it. Most are... 50 kilowatt hours. What, this? This here? As in the speed, the speed at which, uh, the speed at which unloading and loading happens? Where is it? Uh, this here? Am I missing it? The building panel before you build it. Oh, like, if I build it here and then, does it show up? I don't, I don't see it. Hold on, does it just show for the stations filled? Maximum wattage. That's just the maximum wattage, right? It's just the maximum wattage, the power that it uses. I don't think it's... I don't think that's the load speed. Maybe it does reflect the load speed, though, to be fair. Max consumption. Yeah, maybe that is reflective of the of the load speed. I'm not I'm not actually I'm not actually entirely sure. It's it's definitely not like immediately obvious though. If that is what it is. But anyway, look, it doesn't matter because it's fast, one is fast, one is slow. Like that is that is fine. Right. No workers or mechanism on site, but that's okay. We are starting work on the petrochemical combine. That is good. We're going to get that done. Pollution monitoring station isn't really an issue until we start to notice that the uh, that the pollution is in a bad place. I am shocked, by the way, at how quickly this fire uh, station is building. Yeah, so pump jacks. We have a few options. We have a few options here, chat. We have a few options with regards to how we handle the pump jacks. I think maybe the plan is to, I mean, to be fair, it actually, hold on, let me, let me be a big brain for a second, which I know is a bit of a statement, but we could build, we've got a, we got a free construction office, right? We got a free construction office. We can build like seven of these fucking things. Why not build a few out here? We can build a few out there. We can get a few, what is it, free, free aggregate storage. Build that at the border. Nice. And we can get a free open storage. Let's actually get two free open storages. Are they, uh, can I get an unlimited number for free? That's pretty good. Okay, so all we're going to need to do, all we're going to need to do is get the road built here very, very cheaply. Cost me like 2,000 rubles total. And then construction office-wise, let's get Maz trucks. Maz dumpers, that is. Good. Let's get you to do gravel. Because I... Don't care about anything else. Nice. Set your source of gravel. Ah, whoops. Not even connected via road. It's fine. Connect up over here so that we don't have a weird little awkward area. Connect that up there. That's good. And then we need to sort of connect this up with roads. Um, 
I think generally this area over here is a little bit sort of stronger. So let's maybe start, let's maybe start over here. Start over here. Slightly, slightly more oil. Okay, and then that over there. Okay, should we start with should we start with that? Let's see what we let's see what we need in order to make this in order to make this uh, this pump jack. These are big pump jacks, so can it be anticipated? Five point two tons of concrete. That's a bit of a pain in the backside, if I'm being honest. Uh, gravel we can deal with, steel like we can deal with here. I'm not sure that people are going to survive on the bus this long. That's the only problem. What do we think, chat? Do you reckon people will survive on the on the bus? Also, what the heck is going on over here? Oh, it's an oil pump. Okay. Do you reckon people will survive on the bus? Would they make it? I mean, I guess we can find out, right? You can le use labor from the border. I think we'll we'll try with this. We'll try with this. Buses on the bus, people on the bus can actually get surprisingly far. Yeah, I mean, that's to be anticipated. I mean, it is definitely like further than I, further than I think. Let's see. Okay, goods. Okay, construction is stopped. The workers are mechanism, missing resources, concrete, gravel. Let's get more... Let's get a concrete, uh, we'll get a concrete mixer. Concrete mixer thing, and we'll assign the concrete plant over here, and I guess that asphalt plant over there. That's cool, get two of those. What else do you need? Gravel, yep, concrete, yep, steel. We'll get like, how much, how much steel was actually required? 17 tons. I think we can get away with not using a big truck. No, tell a lie. There's only one that deals with more than 17 tons. Get two of those. And then we'll also get a tiny little barn, much like last time, and that'll get us across the line there. Okay, small barn. Love to see it. Right over here. This is actually like a super... This is a super tight little... Tight little affair. This is this is good. This is good. And God, how, how did this truck manage to fit in here? Look at this. Look at the size of this truck. There's literally no room to turn around. This is like a Mr. Bean sketch where where Mr. Bean ends up, you know, perfectly, perfectly parallel parked between two different areas. That that is incredible. Right. Okay. Grab some covered hulls. Uh, sure. Squeeze in some reasonably big trucks as well over there. That's cool. Right. Grab mechanical components. Nice. Okay. I think that's good enough. I think that's good enough. We're going to maybe need to get ourselves a few more. So as a gravel is not assigned. I don't care about gravel. Concrete plant is not assigned. Good. Okay, I think maybe we want to get ourselves more cargo office, uh, cargo offices, uh, construction offices over here. I mean, we might as well, right? One, two, three. Sure. Let's crank them right on up. Fast cars for workers. Do 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 um do cars still like just absolutely break? Do cars still absolutely break the game? The last time that I played with them, personal cars were like a very, 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 like, net negative. Like a huge net negative. Like it's not even freaking close. Yeah, they still clog everything up. Yeah, for that reason, I kind of feel like I just don't want to... <laughs> I don't want to go near them. Yeah. For construction offices? Do they work in construction offices? 
Oh, I see. You mean as like a, a mode of personal transport. I, I see. I mean, to be honest, I'm not even really necessarily concerned about the speed of the bus. The bus does like 80 miles an hour. What does a fast car do? A fast car is slightly faster than that, maybe? Hey, we've not had a single bridging loan yet. Although, to be fair, I have spent the better part of a million and a half rubles. But I've not actually made any money. And we're, we're quite a ways away from actually being able to make money. Fast cars reach the maximum road speed. Hey, look at this. Look at this. We're building the petrochemical combine. Whatever the heck that does. Microbuses for road construction. Yeah, I mean, I use most... I've used a lot of microbuses in my time. I've used a lot of microbuses in my time. The little little orange things, they're pretty good. They're pretty good. Yeah, I think we should be fine. I think we should be fine for... Um, I guess we'll see, right? Because the buses are presumably going to set off at some point soon. Come on, then. Set off. What's the issue? Fire trucks, please. Have we actually finished the fire station? Oh my god, we have. Hey, that's great. It just finished. Um, nobody's really within range to be a firefighter. But that's cool. What if I get a little one of those? Sure. That's gonna cut things. That's gonna cut things down dramatically. Uh, let's nab ourselves. Let's. Let's get some cheap fire trucks. Let's get some cheap fire trucks. I don't particularly care. Okay, nice. Oh my goodness, the train station is literally built. Oh, we're getting there. We're we're doing it. We're doing it. We're freaking going. What's the issue here? Prefab panels? Do we have prefab panels here? Oh, we do. It's just taking the truck about a billion, billion, billion years. Level 4 extinguishing power is really bad. Yeah, but level level anything above 4 extinguishing power is is really okay. You know what? Fine. I'll buy I'll buy I'll buy another truck. I'll buy another truck just so we don't have like a massive a massive extermination level level event as has happened before. Hey, look, the buses are the buses are dispatching. Hey, that's great. I guess maybe they were waiting until all of the resources were delivered here. Chat, I actually can't believe it, but we are making some pretty serious freaking progress on this. This is looking really, really good. I like this little setup. Pump jack piping. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that now whilst we're waiting for all the other stuff to happen. Um, because there's nothing else that we really need to... There's nothing else that we really need to happen right now, is there? We're waiting for prefab panels over there. God, oh, it's a slow process. And they literally cost nothing. I got a thousand rubles for 45 tons. <laughs> a thousand rubles for 45 tons. Oh, whoops. Sorry. Sorry, everyone. You can't actually go to work on the train platform. Not yet, anyway. It'll happen at some point. It'll happen at some point, but not, not quite yet. No, you're going to have to continue to go to the, the railway platform. Although there's a lot of demand here. There's a lot of demand here. Uh, queue up a self-built storage with loading. Oh, you mean, um, uh, for the oil. Yeah, so what I'm going to do for the oil, I've had, I've been having to think. We've got a modded large oil storage with loader, which I think is what I'm going to do. A telescope gasometer. Uh, that's freaking cool. I've not used one of these. Holy cow, look at this. Look at this. I'm going to build one of these. This is sick. Let's build it over here. Sure. Fund that. And then we'll let the... We'll let the video game do this. We need asphalt as well. But that's fine. Okay. So we're going to get everything to sort of... Pump towards there. That's fine. I really haven't messed around with oil much at all. Uh, underground pipes now exist. That's fine. Pumping harbor. Don't care about that. Oil, fuel, loading, unloading. Don't care about that. We still need to sort out the... Uh, what do you call it? The, um, the cooling tower. The potential cooling tower. 
And then, of course, there is the big one, uh, which is all of the pipe, uh, all of the pipe stuff that needs to happen. Also, I think we're... Shockingly, we're actually pretty much done with regards to some of these pumps. Like, all of the basic components, all of the gravel, all of the, the concrete, they're actually all there. I think we should connect up some more. I think that's exactly what we're going to do. Okay, nice. I presume this is all going to reach, but if it doesn't, then we'll fix it. Is that actually everything? Legitimately, I think it is. That's already connected up. Uh, we'll fund that, but then we'll also just build a... One of these over there. Okay, that's looking good. So that's going to immediately pump all of these into, into action. Pump that up. Pump that up. Pump that up. Pump that up. And pump that up. I think it, honestly, 3,000 3, meters should be more than enough. In fact, it actually might, it might actually mean that we start sending a few trucks down to the petrochemical combine over here. That's fine, though. That's fine. If that ends up happening, then that's, then that's what ends up happening. Cool. Very, very cool, in fact. There we go. We're actually getting to work. We're actually doing what we need to do. That is great. Love to see it. Very, very nice indeed. Okay, so that's looking that's looking great. We're also working on this too. That's nice. How's this all coming along? We need steel. We're going to get the steel there. I think the game has changed, by the way. I think the game has changed where you only get like workers sent over here if there is... If there is the components actually required. Is that is that the case? Has that been has that been changed? One reported crimes that was not patrolled. Yeah, I feel like that's going to become a, a little bit more of a reoccurring problem. Also, I think we need. I think we need more. Um, I think we need more big trucks now. What are they called? Maz trucks. Yeah, I think we need a few more Maz trucks. Let's buy two more. We'll buy. Where is it? It's open hull, Maz 1, Maz 2. Okay. Two more of those. What are we actually working on right now? Combine, mostly. 21-story prefab flat. That's okay. City hall. That's fine. Telescope, gasometer. That's actually within range. And then also the large oil well is, is within range. Oh, I don't actually have a police car. Do I need a police car? I suppose so. I mean, a police car only really needs space for three. We don't need four passengers, right? Sure. Let's go with these cars. They look pretty cool. I have absolutely no idea how police works. Like, what is the... What is the point? Is there... Is there one? Oh, God. It's just so slow. Look at how slow it is. Hold on. Can I change this, actually? Maybe we get a... What's it called? A, um, a storage. Open storage free. Yeah. We get more of these. These, of course, are temporary, much like everything I build. When I say temporary, it's not actually temporary. And we're going to say... So, steel can be from the first one. Bricks can be from the second one. Prefab from this one boards from this one. Steel. Prefab. Bricks. Boards. There we go. Temporary. Yeah, it's very, very temporary. Very temporary. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Nice. Okay. Good. So that's going to fix... That's going to fix it all. Okay. Uh, police is complicated. First report the crime, then the criminal gets sent to court. Oh, yeah. I did forget about the court. I forgot about the court. I forgot about the secret police as well. Do we need the secret police? 
I mean, I suppose, like, nobody actually needs the secret police in the sense that <laughs> they're, they're probably like, not a net positive uh, in anyone's in anyone's life, but... You get the picture. Also, how much does it cost for this pollution monitoring station to get built? 847 bucks? Let's freaking do it. Buildings without a power supply? Oh, yeah, it's because we don't have a power supply over here. Not yet, anyway. Oh, it's for checking citizen loyalty. I suppose that makes sense. Missing concrete. Build an orphanage? Suspend construction of that. Oh, I don't care. I don't care about the road. I don't care about that road. That that road literally does not matter. That road doesn't matter either. Is that the... Are these oil wells, like, within range? So why are you not... Hold on. Why are you not... Building this? The steel is here. Source for steel is not assigned. It is. It's not. It's over there. My B. My B. There we go. The source is without steel. That's a lie. It's not without steel. Okay, I will I will zone an orphanage. I will zone an orphanage. I will not be the one to build it. I will not spend I will not spend my money on it, but I will spend the state's money on it, or I will spend the state's resources on it. Right, where does it squeeze in here? State infrastructure. Oh bloody hell, schools. Chat, how could I forget about schools? I haven't built a single school yet. How could you let me forget? Is there even space for a school now? How have I built a city hall slash accounting office before I built a flipping a school for the nation's children? <laughs> what sort of an idiot would say that education's not important? What sort of what sort of an idiot would say that? Okay, we're building a jumbo kindergarten on top of the local hill. <laughs> okay, this is. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is ridiculous. Okay, I mean, we don't have an excavator in the office at the moment because they're all busy doing some stupid... Some stupid something or other. Uh, but that's what we're going to do. <laughs> they can roll down to the clinic. <laughs> yes. 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 Glorious idea. Where the hell are you going? Oh, you're going to the telescope gasometer. Okay, well, it's taken about a billion years for these two excavators to get here. Very annoying. But that's okay. That is what it is. Right, there we go. Steel is all here. Now let's dispatch a truck. Some vehicles are without fuel. Seriously? Oh, is that maybe like a big issue? Hold on. Is that maybe a big issue? Do we need... Do we need power for this? I don't think we need power for this. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Okay, everything needs fuel. Everything needed fuel. Okay. Okay, well that makes sense. That makes perfect sense. That was a bit of a... That You know what? That does actually make sense. It does actually make sense. Let's get another... Another two gas stations over here. I don't think anyone is going, going to use the new ones. Oh, this is a... This is a traffic jam for the ages. Well, problem solved. I am a problem solver. That's me. Okay, we can hear the hum of construction at the petrochemical combine. That's looking good. Uh, are our excavators, bulldozers back yet? No. Not yet. So we can't, uh... Can't work on that quite yet. What's the issue with here? Prefab panels? 85 tons of prefab panels? Why are you... Sources without prefab panels? No. The source has prefab panels. Source has prefab panels. It definitely has prefab panels. Okay. 
Although that maybe makes me think that I've messed up the rest of them. Hold on. Bricks. Boards. Okay, there we go. Redo that just to just to be on the safe side. Okay, good. Well, that was a bit that was a bit touch and go there, but I think we got there in the end. And the good news is that throughout this, mostly the petrochemical plant has been has been operating, it's been building, it's been working. Uh, concrete plant is working as intended. That's good. It's very good. Are we starting to build the platform yet? Not quite yet. We actually, shockingly enough, might need a few more buses to transport people. Is that going to be our last two? Is that going to be our last two purchases at this office? I think so. Sure. Okay, well, I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy with that. We've got a little bit more concrete to get at the accounting office, but then we're going to be done with that. Very, very nice indeed. That's coming along nicely. How's the big old traffic jam over here? It's actually pretty much cured itself. That's great. Sources without prefab panels. I don't care about that. I don't care about that at all. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, we spent one and a half million. And what have we made for ourselves? Citizen's loyalty seems too low. Execution. I mean, indoctrination, training. Get them trained. What do we need? We literally just need people, right? Yeah, we just need people. Okay, it's just a matter of time before we get that done. That's good. The gasometer is good. We're pretty much finished with the groundworks, actually. And then once the groundworks are done, we can get the excavator done, which means that we can get the kindergarten built. Uh, yeah. Oh, we need a school for training. Darn it. Darn it. What about the secret police? We should definitely zone the secret police, right? I need somewhere secret for the secret police to go. What about if we put the secret police next to the sewage, the sewage works over here? For citizens? Is secret police for citizens? I mean... <laughs> it's so secret. Nobody, nobody's ever going to figure out what this building is right across the, right across the other side of the road. I'm going to make sure that it's built, uh, it's built with just the nicest, the nicest road. The finest, only the finest road for our, for our glorious secret police. That is like a horrific, bit. <laughs> that's a horrific bit of building. <laughs> but it's it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Put the secret police inside the schools. Yeah, unfortunately, we don't have any schools to put the secret police in. Um, I would if we had any schools, but I don't, so we're gonna have to wait. I'll deploy them. I'll deploy them literally everywhere that we possibly can, though. Truly, the finest road. It's a secret road, though. Nobody's ever gonna... Nobody's ever gonna know. Nobody's ever gonna notice. Nobody's gonna suspect. Temperature in building is too low. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's May, and already the temperature in the building is too low. Footpath across the river? Hey, I actually like that. That's a great idea. That's a fantastic idea. Pedestrian bridge steel. Pedestrian bridge concrete. Cannot end above water. Sure. Hey, that's legit. Look at that. Hey, this is the route for tourists to get into town too. <laughs> They're gonna have to go past the <laughs> past the the headquarters of the secret police. Oh, there's not a prison actually. There's not a prison. That's true. How much does that bridge cost to build actually? Six hundred and thirty rubles. Footpaths are an absolute steal. They are an absolute freaking steal. They're so good. Right. I need a few more prefab panels. We're getting them finally. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Also, how are the police doing? Missing courthouse. Yeah, I need a courthouse. Where's the courthouse going to go, chat? I need to queue that up for construction too. What about over here? What do we think about this area? I feel like this area is ripe for residential development. Obviously, this is going to get demolished. We're going to... Have this as the trains. Oh, yeah. Cue the heating up thingy. Yeah, the heating plant. That's a good point. I do need a prison, though. I need to get a prison first before I get anything else. What about a prison over here? 
What about a prison over here? It's going to be a bit difficult to get to. Although it, it does seem like a nice little place. Like, maybe even next to the... Maybe even next to this area. Maybe even next to this area. What is this? How big is... Uh, it, the courthouse is quite big, right? Courthouse small. Wait, do we, do we need to try our... Wait. What do you mean? We need to try our... We need to try our criminals? We don't need to try our criminals. We don't need a courthouse. That's not required. What about we put the... What about we put the prison over here? Prison is... Yeah, the prison is quite large. You need a court? That's very unrealistic. My immersion has been broken. Let's maybe, I tell you what, let's make sure that it's on the NATO border. Right next to the pollution monitoring station. In fact, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll, put the, we'll put the prisoners in here so when they breathe in, they can suck in the pollution and stop it drifting over towards the city. <laughs> it's a flawless plan. It's a truly flawless plan. <laughs> uh, okay. And you know what? Maybe let's, in that same sort of vein... Let's, let's get a courthouse. Let's get a courthouse, like, on the way to the prison. Because let's be brutally honest, it's like, once you go in that direction, you're not coming back. So there's no point in, like, you know, making the journeys, making the journeys any longer. It's literally, it's literally that easy. It's, it's so basic. I can't believe I didn't think of this beforehand. Oh, it's so, it's so easy. It's so easy. It's so good. Okay, how's this all coming along? This is all coming along good. It looks like the trucks have finally... Excavators, that is, have finally made their way back. Let's get a kindergarten. Oh, I need to get a gym as well. Oh, I could get a beach. Oh, chat, I could get a beach. What about a beach? Like, right opposite the sewage treatment area. Look at this. Look at... I mean, this could be... This could be the next... This could be the next Monaco. Beach doesn't work during winter. Uh, technically, it does work. It's just not. <laughs> it's not occupied. <laughs> um, okay. What do, what do I need? I need a, a school. School. What's it called? Kindergarten. I don't even have an orphanage yet. God, there's so many things you need to build now, isn't there? What do you mean? I need a free excavator at the construction office. I built all the. I've got a free excavator. Sm <laughs> smells like Monaco. Yeah! Where the bleeding heck are all my trucks? What the heck are you doing over here? Are you still drifting back? Okay, whatever. Also, I need to get uh, that. Yeah, sure. Get that connected up. Cool. Have we actually built any of these yet? No, we just need a few more work days. 34 workers. That's fine. Orphanage isn't really needed. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. Okay. Uh, please set your big construction office to mechanism with trucks. Oh, is that not set? Oh, you're absolutely right. You're absolutely right. I didn't even realize. You're truly, truly correct. Okay. Uh, yeah, we've already got all of our buses in place, so I can't even. I can't even get them back. Where are they at the moment? They must be... Did they? No, oh, they're over here. I get. To be fair, that is kind of like a valid thing for them to be doing. I just don't want them to be doing it right now. Okay, so that's gonna be that's gonna be that. Also, look at that. The twenty-one story prefabricated flats. They're built, and two hundred and twenty people have literally instantly moved in, and nobody has a job. Okay, that's fine. You know what I'm gonna do? You know what I'm gonna do, chat? I should have done this a while ago, but I'm gonna do it now anyway. I'm going to build a railway construction office. I'm going to build a railway construction office. I don't care. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Uh, a large one? A large one? Maybe? Hey, Dane. How's it going? Let's do... 
Let's do it over here. I feel like this is the dream, the dream place for it to be. Perfect. Okay, I'm gonna build this. It's gonna cost me 40,000 rubles. I don't care. Uh, I'm gonna build electrified railway. It's a bit ugly, but it's it's fine. Too sharp of a turn. Not on my watch. Start construction of that. Good. And let's freaking go. Let's freaking go, baby. Gonna need extra aggregate storage? I also think that. I also think that. There we go. Uh, let's batch produce with rubles. There we go. Nice. And then let's see. Right. Let's get, let's get a train set. Get two of those. 40 workers max. Easy. Uh, I think I'll just import. I think I'll just import everything, right? Do I need electricity? I think I've got electricity, actually. Yeah, just import everything for now. That's totally fine. It, I'm really, I'm really looking for, it's included, it's included in this one, but I think you're right. I don't think it's included in the base one. The, uh, I don't think gravel's included in the base one. I really just need, I need, like, I need something for my people to do. There you go, crank that up. Buy, buy some more train units as well. And in fact, do we not get a train unit sometime soon? Oh, finally, these things are back. Oh, as if you just taken a bulldozer out? If you just literally taken a bulldozer out? I was just gonna build a school. It's fi it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. I tell you what, there's there's a place there's a place for you know Soviet architecture, uh, but it is. It's, it is horrific to look at, um, but it's kind of beautiful in a way. I mean, you see some of the statues, right? The statues and the monuments made out of concrete. It's, uh, you know, sometimes less is more. There is no way this is going to be a road that ever works, is it? If this... Okay, you know what? You know what? No. I am confident there's never going to be a fire. There is never going to be a fire. We've not had a single fire yet. We've not had a single, a single fire. Too steep of a descent? There's no way that's too steep of a descent. You just need to, you need to deal with it, video game. I'm sorry, but you do. Does anybody live in any of these buildings? Let's get somebody moved out of these, uh, out of these buildings. Yeah, relocate. And ditch this stupid old house. There we go. Nice, and get you through here. I would really like this to connect up. I mean, it will connect up. It's just a case of how small the increments that we that we do it in. It, it, as I say, the, the, this is a the strange thing about this game is that if you do if you do things in small increments, it will eventually just work. It will eventually just work. Right? What is that? Fun that construction. That's fine. Uh, that's good. Let's get... Let's get a path down here. There we go. Nice small increments again. And it... What do you know? What once looked impossible has now been built. Right. Is that going to allow for access throughout... The city. I'm gonna ditch this, ditch that, and then we'll be able to build a pathway straight through here. Gonna upgrade this too. Build that, and build that. Nice. Okay. Good. 
Okay, this kindergarten, I'm just gonna build the kindergarten. Also, what's this? Citizens' loyalty seems to be low. Delete. Don't care. Right, we need a school as well, chat. Where's the school gonna go? I need some- I need some creative solutions. I need some creative solutions. How's this looking? It's looking not too bad. Looking not too bad at all. It's looking great. Okay, but at least the kindergarten is sorted now. That's good. Hopefully we will stop slowly losing people. It's pretty much the entirety of the town. Next to the 21 storage. Oh, over here? For a regular school rather than a jumbo school. Put the school near the prison? That's We could roll them up into one. Uh, school to prison <laughs> School to prison pipeline. Yeah, that's a real... That's a real cheery thought, eh? We technically need a university as well if we want to do our... Want to do our stuff. I mean, I was thinking, I mean, there's a potential space for a school in here, actually. It's actually not a bad place for it, like right in the center of this. Right in the center of this area. It's probably all within walking distance as well. But I think we're going to need a, I think we're going to need a jumbo school. I really, really do. What about down here? Actually, you know what? Here is not necessarily a bad idea. I think it's also within walking distance of pretty much everywhere. I mean, this would have been an ideal place for a school, to be fair. But now that we've got it, I don't really want to. Population, by the way, 4,008. Average lifespan is 72. That's not bad. Uh, ain't this going to block the future NATO railway? I was kind of envisioning the future NATO railway coming down here, through here, and around here. Because the NATO, although, as long as it connects into the existing network, I mean... Down here, in here, into here. Yeah. So that's fine. Uh, although, to be fair, we could probably separate the passenger and the uh, cargo line. Although, that being said, I'm not really sure that it... I'm not really sure that it matters. Uh, next to the well. Over here. Over here. School over here. It's not a bad idea. It's not a bad idea. Walking distance, though, to everywhere around town. I don't know. I feel like here is not... I feel like here is not bad. I don't mind this area as, as, a, as an idea. I mean... Alternatively, there is the option of just, like, destroying the, the accounting office and building it here. I mean, that is the most sensible place to do it. I think, probably. Um... Although here is also pretty good. Yeah. I really like the idea of putting it here. The problem is... Yeah, we're basically filled... We're basically filled over here. I'm gonna relook... Yeah, we're literally... We've literally filled the residential building completely to the top. Okay, first things first. We need to zone another residential building. We definitely need to do that. There's a whole bunch of space over here. So let's freaking go. Okay, we'll get that built. We'll start the process of doing that. For now, let's try. In fact, you know what? This is a, a no-brainer. I tell you what, this is what we're going to do. Temporarily. It's always a red flag whenever I say temporarily, because it's never, ever temporary. Uh, we can squeeze one in, like, over here, right? This fuel station absolutely does not need to be here. Okay, so I'm going to go over there. I'm going to go over there, and then... Is gonna go over here. We're gonna to return to the original idea that I had. Squeeze this in here. Brilliant. I'm gonna build this one, and we're gonna watch it all. We're all gonna watch it immediately get overflowed with little, with little cherubs. Okay. There's no space between between those houses over there. Clearly, nobody envisioned. Seriously? This is this has got to be connectable. I knew it was connectable. Video game. I you, you didn't need to debate me with that. Who? 
who would design such tantalizingly path-sized shape? I mean, look at how perfect this looks. Look at how perfect this looks. It's unbelievably frustrating. Anyway, uh, we're building that. Build that. That's fine. Okay, get the school built. There's at least one input. And then we're going to get a second school soon, right? Walking distance is basically the entirety of town, with the exception of this area, which is where we're going to build ourselves a second school. And that is going to sort us out for the foreseeable future. Probably, maybe, I don't know. Uh, I don't care about building schools. I want to start getting back to the good the good stuff, the oil. Uh, is it going to fit in there? Surely nobody lives here. Everybody lives here. Everybody loves a beachfront property. Uh, maybe we can squeeze in a school here. Sure. I mean, look, it doesn't matter. We get, we get two, we get two schools. That's fine. Okay, boom, build that there, and let's also get a little pathway. Oh, that needs to be built. Pathway over there, allows direct access, should be fine, right? Nice. And build this, and build this. Cool. Okay, all of that stuff is now built. We never have to worry about education, quite literally, ever again. And the students in the classrooms are gonna go over the top. Yep. As anticipated, they went over the top. Can I actually see? If I click, it's a good thing that it's a good thing that I have a city hall accounting office to check exactly how many children between the ages of um, of seven and twenty one we have. We've got six hundred and twenty one children between the ages of seven and twenty one. And we have capacity for about 250, or 300, maybe, to be... I mean, we need <laughs> we need another... We need another two schools, three schools, four schools, probably. Yeah. 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 Maybe I just crank up the loyalty level. Maybe that's the solution. Maybe we just tell people to get loyal. Kindergarten's looking good, though. Kindergarten's looking fine. Population, 4,011. I'm pretty happy with that. That's pretty good. That is pretty good. Holy cow. The petrochemical plant is actually really starting to take shape. But we're still like 12,000 workdays away from it actually being built. So there we go. Have we built any oil jacks yet? No, we're painfully close, though. That's good. Uh, telescope gasometer is looking very, very good too. Pretty happy with that. Oh, what are people doing over here? People are walking around. They shouldn't be. They shouldn't be. Oh, they're ju they're literally just going to church. That's fine. Yeah, there shouldn't be anything else happening over there. Nothing else within walking distance. I don't believe. No, they're not even. They're not even able to construct the the telescope gasometer thing. Okay. This is looking nice. I'm actually really... I'm really happy with how this is going to work. I think this is going to work out really, really nicely. I mean, we're almost done with this bit of unfinished railroad, and then we should be able to get... I mean, it should just branch, and literally all four tracks should be built all at the same time. That's kind of the dream. Need a little bit of concrete here. That's fine. What's the issue? The sources without mechanical components. The sources without steel. No? What's the issue here? Sources that mechanical component components are sources without steel. That is a that is a barefaced lie. We do have steel here. Yeah, we absolutely do have steel here. We absolutely have mechanical components here too. Okay, not sure what more can be dealt with over there. Uh, should we do heating? Should we do heating, chat? I feel like maybe that's a necessary a necessary evil that we need to perhaps get to grips with. But I also maybe perhaps don't want to get to grips with it. Yeah. Concrete blocks are better. I mean, I feel like concrete... 
a technical office too. That's a good point. Uh, concrete blocks, I feel like they're... Oh, I sh oh sure, I should change it to uh, temperature here. Yeah, temperature here is much more useful than any other metric. Um, the concrete blocks, I feel like they're quite modular. They're like, quite easy to build, like if you're able to... If you're able to do them, if you're able to build them, you're able to build them, you know? This is looking good stuff. Soon we're going to have all four wagons out at the same time, which is very exciting. <laughs> why, why did that one despawn? Why did the one full, full of rails and, like, useful stuff despawn? Ah, miserable. Miserable. Although, to be fair, I could get a, uh... I could get a little... Here we go. No. Nope. Ah, there we go. The, the, the one that we wanted to win ended up winning there. It's good. Yeah, start, start building this one. Start building this one. Go, 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 go. Okay, we're going to get a one-way system here, which may or may not... May or may not make a difference. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how that we'll see how that works. Hey passionate heart, how's it going? Not too bad. We're good here. Potato Grad is looking great. I haven't renamed the city. Chat. Chat. We haven't renamed Bratislava to Potato Grad. What the heck have I been doing? Potato Grad can't be officially reborn until until we actually officially name Potato Grad. Maybe I should wait though. Maybe I should wait until we have literally all of the basic services first. To be fair, that seems like a pretty reasonable, a pretty reasonable thing to, a pretty reasonable thing to, uh, to ask for. Okay. <laughs> Rename the real life Bratislava as well. Yeah, that maybe is a little bit, a little bit more challenging in the grand, in the grand scheme of things. Also, these are some chunky points. Have these points been added? Like, these are, are these a new visualization chat? I feel like these, these must be. In honor of the great and beautiful improvements. Yeah, true. Although, if you're suggesting that um, Potato Grad was ever anything but beautiful and impressive, then you're going to the gulag, I'm afraid. Sorry. Hate to say it, but... Straight to the slammer. God, I'll tell you what. These, these cheap... These cheap, crappy open storage things are just... They're so bloody miserable. I really... Ugh, they're... They're just... They're just miserable. Courthouse is looking good. There we go. Finally, the petrochemical combine is really coming together now. That's looking... That's looking fantastic. Citizens' loyalty is too low. I don't care. I don't care. We can deal with that later. Right, have we built a singular well yet? No. <laughs> no, we haven't. We haven't. <laughs> Oh my lordy. Okay. Um, we are... Oh, we've spent two million rubles. We haven't made a single dime. We've not made a single... A single kopeck. Not made anything. God, it's miserable. Okay, let's get... Um, let's get... Let's get some liquid... Let's get some liquid pumping stations together. Pipeline overpass. I don't need a pipeline overpass. Forwarding pump mirrored. I don't need a forwarding pump mirrored. Underground pumping station. I think I do need an underground pumping station, to be fair. I think I need a lot of these. Is that what I want, though? Is that what I want? A forwarding pump is literally just one in, one input, one output. I need... I need lots of, I need lots of inputs. Oh, goodness gracious me. These are some hefty modded things. Pipeline overpass rail. I don't need a pipeline overpass rail. I don't need any of that stuff. Keep it all underground. Yeah, I think, I think... Wait, hold on. Can it all be underground? Can it actually all be underground, Chad? Is that a thing? Oh, this has been sunk. I see, I see. Okay, 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 okay. Let's get, uh... Let's do it backwards. Oh, okay. This is cool. This is very, very cool. 
you're gonna need a lot. Yeah, I'm gonna need. I'm gonna need turns. I need a lot, lot. Okay. Okay. The good. The the telescope. The telescope gasometer is is coming along nicely. Right. So we can build. We have to build an underground pipe connection. What's the cost difference, chat? Do we know what the cost difference is? What would that be? be 26,000 rubles. 26,000 rubles. Hypothetically. Okay, but an above ground? Of a similar sort of length? Uh, 16,000. Um, okay, what about an above ground? Do we have the opportunity for an above ground pump? Two pipe inputs, six outputs. Two pipe outputs, six inputs. I think that's more what we need, right? Yeah, I think that's more what we need. I don't think I want to... I don't think I actually want to do it underground. Always dangerous game using demolish tool. A lot can be destroyed. Okay. Yeah, I think we wanna I think we wanna do I think we wanna do this. Cancel. Okay, good. Yeah, I think yeah, keeping the pipes for near the refineries is a good is a good plan. It's a good plan. Okay, we want to we want to connect this up here. But we also don't want to We don't want to do ourselves we don't want to do ourselves short. I mean we can only make pipes so long. I think I think somewhere like here is probably fine. Let me sort of uh, roughly sketch out. Ah, oh, lovely. A glorious bit of pipeline infrastructure. I mean, that can feed directly in there, right? Yeah, totally fine. Building is in the way. I presume that's the, the road that you're referring to there, video game. Oh, this is going to be so... <laughs> it's going to be so messy, isn't it? Okay, good. Uh, do I need to use all the inputs there? No, not really. I really don't. Let's not... Let's not overcomplicate things. Cool. And... Let's get this as an output. Hopefully this shouldn't be too long. Too long. Are you kidding me? I mean, to be fair, we could always get like a... Is it, is it much Is it much too long? It's not that much too long. Okay, I just deleted all the, deleted all the pipes. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Not bitter or anything. It's it's okay. Just deleted all the flipping pipes. Okay. All right. Again, but make it somewhat better looking. Yeah, it doesn't make a difference. It doesn't make a difference to the cost, like how much you elevate them, though. So it's it's basically it's the same. It's the same cost, sort of overall. Right, delete that, and delete that too. Get the pipe uh, pumping station in a slightly more acceptable position now. That's actually perfect. That's perfect. That's really, really good. And that actually has connected up two for us, right? Let's uh, delete this road. Nice. Connect it up here. Good. Okay. Right. Let's let's leave it like let's leave it like this for now. 
<laughs> Tell it to the maintenance crew? To be fair, you're not wrong. I would hate to... I'd hate to actually look at this hellish sort of structure in real life, but... In pretend worlds, it's actually fine. Also, chat, do you remember when they... You remember when they made the change? Is, do you remember when they made the change where you didn't have to delete... Where you didn't have to delete, like, the entirety of the pipe just to redo it? I remember that. That was... That was flipping game-changing. Like, that was so freaking good. Okay, this is absolutely horrific. Let me, uh... Delete this road here. You can always redo the road. The road is easy to do. Pipes, however... Are you serious? What building is in the way? What? Is it the other pipe? Okay, whatever. Just... Thank goodness. Okay. Right. Uh, can we feed this in here? Building in the way. See if we can get this one in here. There we go. That looks good. And then that still leaves us a few inputs to, to sort of hook up. I do need to replace the road, though, and I'm going to try and do that right now. There we go. Nice. And we'll connect this up over here as well. That's good. Okay. Execution worthy to ask about City Skylines. On the contrary, I actually think City Skylines is one of the most up... Is one of the, the most hyped upcoming... Maybe the most hyped uh, upcoming city builders. So, no, that is officially... That's A-OK -okay with me. Let's start construction on all of this. Good. Okay. Uh, I am super hyped for City Skylines 2. That is going to be a great game. I genuinely cannot wait. It is going to be Omega Pog. Omega Pog. As they say in the game, Omega Pog. How's this looking? How's the petrochemical plant looking? We're almost ready. We're almost ready. Is the petrochemical plant going to be ready before we're ready to process oil? That is a distinct possibility. Okay. Right. Okay, next thing that we need to do... Let's see if we can try and get... Let's see if we can try and get ourselves a pump. A forwarding pump. Very, very basic forwarding pump here. And we're going to just run this across the ground for as long as we possibly can. Sticking in a pump wherever we need to. Um, I have played Kerbal 2. I, I, um, I have played... Where am I going to put this in? We're going to put it in at the back. Um, I've played a bit of Kerbal 2. To be honest, I played, I played enough to, uh, to know that it's nowhere near like, ready to play in any sort of meaningful way. I mean, I follow a few um, KSP uh, YouTubers, and it's like, they really sort of struggle to, I think, bring themselves to play it. Which is a real shame. Which is a real, real shame. But hey-ho. Hello, comrade, comrade Drupin. How's it going? Factorio, the Factorio music maestro himself has graced us with his presence. Should I slam this in the back, in the back here? Is this a good place for it, chat? I feel like this is a fine place. Yeah, I feel that's pretty good. I feel that's pretty good. I feel that's okay. 145,000 rubles worth of, worth of pipe work there. Sharp intake of breath, as they say. This is, <laughs> this is such a mad construction project. Oh my god. Oh, lordy. Okay, here's a question, chat. Here's a question. Maybe we should have a poll on this. Um, do you think more people are going to die of pollution poisoning? Or do you think more people are going to die of the cold, harsh winter that is, <laughs> is going to come upon Potato Grad like, like, a, like, a, like a tidal wave? <laughs> oh, it's going to be so nasty. It's going to be so nasty. 
Also, this is looking actually legitimately cool. I like this. This is this is looking great. Uh, let's fix this. Uh, let's fix this system. There we go. Okay, you teleported through there, but that's fine. I am going to need to change this. I am going to need to change this. We're going to need to put that in there, that in there. That in there and that in there. Okay, that's fine. It'll probably be fine. Why not both? Oh, uh, that's true, actually. Yeah, we're probably gonna have a... We're we're gonna have a, a bad... It's gonna be bad. It's gonna be bad, isn't it? It's gonna be bad. Also, I feel like I have... I feel like I have created a... Absolute monstrosity. And I kind of hate it. Can we put a signal in here? No, I think it's too... I think it's too, uh... It's too close here. Get a signal in there. Get a signal in there. That's perfect. That's good. Okay, that should be fine, right? It's... It's a little bit... It's a little bit more disjointed. I feel like it maybe works much less optimally than it should. But that's okay, because the Central Committee have decreed that it's what we're going to be doing. So it's what we're going to be doing. You're lost now. Okay. <laughs> Wait, there's no train on the track here. Also, I am going to need to manually intervene and build this. Okay, you know what? I take it all back. My my friendly intervention to build to build signals. Clearly, it was a bad idea. I take it all back. Just remove them all. Just remove them all. There is no point. There is no point. Also, if you lived next to this uh, to this railway crossing here, you would you would go insane from the dinging pretty darn quickly. Pretty darn quickly. All right. How's our school? How's our school doing? Actually fine. Actually fine. How about this school? Also actually fine. How's kindergarten doing? Also totally fine. Court is pretty much built. That's great. The prison has yet to start construction, but that's because the road is still being worked on. That's okay. We can leave that. We can leave that for now. This road over here is is fine. Petrochemical place is literally one load more, uh, one more load of steel away from completion. Telescopic gasometer. That's fine. Have we finished our first pump jack yet? No, and of course, when when we do finish our first pump jack, we're gonna have to get electricity set up. But I think I'll just purchase electricity on a manual. I'll I'll purchase it manually from the border. I'll I'll auto build all the sort of different different things that I need to get. Yeah, we're about to finish two actually. That's quite exciting. We're about to finish two uh, two thingies. Okay, good. Got groundworks to go. To be fair, it's really not. It's not anything but workers. That is to say, it is only workers that are stopping, uh, that are stopping construction. It is literally only workers that are stopping construction. I think. Also, how much steel? How much steel are we going to have to deliver? Shockingly, not that much. And it should all just be delivered like here, right? We're going to have to deliver it in multiple loads, but it's actually quite a short journey for the steel to be delivered to any of the sort of corresponding components. Yeah, we're actually starting to work on the pipeline already. Pipeline's already a third of the way done. Obviously, we're going to need to build this. I know we're going to have to deal with that, but that's fine. Right. After we're done with this, how do we want to do the output? How do we want to do the output? Do we want to immediately load it onto a train, or do we want to pipe it to the border and then load it onto a train? What do we think? What do we think, chat? Are we piping Are we piping to a loading station like over here and then shuffling it into the border or just loading it straight onto the train? I feel like maybe loading it straight onto a train is not the worst idea in the world, but I'm also very amenable in both directions. What the hell are you doing? Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. That was daft, wasn't it? That was bloody daft. I'm for train. I'm for train too. Okay, let's, um... Can we relocate more than... More than one person at a time? I don't think we can, right? 
don't think we can. I think, can we, can we like mass relocate people? Hmm. I think we have to do it manually, don't we? Okay. Lead a pipe across the border to sell off oil? No, not as far as I'm aware. All right, let's manually relocate all these people from here. Central Committee has decreed everybody living in this in this neighborhood will unfortunately have to be removed from their house, but you'll get nice, beautiful, new, functional Soviet housing. And it's functional. It may be, it may be ugly, but it's functional. Okay. okay. I feel like grids, grids are definitely the most efficient, but they're also the most soulless. You know what I mean? They're also the most soulless. Okay, you don't like it when I do that video game. Good. Okay. This is going to be a big project to build as well. It's a good thing that we got a rail construction office. Okay. Let's get that all demolished. Good stuff. Okay. We kept this. We kept this area. Exquisite. Okay, next question, chat. Do we want to merge? Do we want to merge? Oh, it's so close. It's literally just done. We caught it. We caught it as it literally just finished. Nice. Um, do we want to do... Do we want to do the passengers and the cargo trains on the same line? I think the answer to that is almost certainly no. It's It's got to be no, right? Like, because otherwise we're going to have, like, a massive delay. Although... How many trains will actually be running through this area? Probably not that many, right? I mean, there'll be a few, but not that many. Right, um, let's think about where we want to do this. I think we want the sort of oil loading, unloading platform, regardless, to probably be like over here somewhere. I'm thinking this area is pretty good. More trains equals more good. Yeah, but you're biased because you, you're a factorio, a factorio nut. And you, I mean, I've seen what you can do with trains. It's very impressive. It makes me, it makes me feel a little bit, uh, a little bit ashamed about my own trains, to be honest. In fact, no, let me rephrase that. It makes me feel very ashamed about my, my trains. Okay, let's do, let's do. I, can, I, can I flatten the ground, maybe? Maybe I flatten the ground. Oh, but that's going to take about a billion years. How, how are you flattening that ground that quickly? And yet you're not flattening this ground at any meaningfully decent speed. Okay. The ground mechanics in this game I don't understand. I, I, do, not un I do not understand it. It's not a problem. Right. Oil, fuel, loading and unloading. Let's... Let's build with the idea of scale in mind. Uh, we'll build over here. Right? And I'll also build a telescopic fuel thing and a bitumen thing storage facility in this area. This is gonna get... I'm just... This is gonna get tight really, really quickly, isn't it? It's okay, though. It's okay, comrade. I've never had a bad idea in my life. It'll be it'll be totally fine. Right. That goes in there. That goes in there. This is maybe a good candidate for underground piping. Underground pipe work. Kind of like that idea. Okay, connect it up with uh, roads, even though I don't believe in roads. That is horrific. That's horrific. 
There is, there's about a million ways that that could look way better than it actually does. But I don't care. That's fine. Okay, so the next question is, the next question is, now that we got this out, out of the way, let's get ourselves, let's get ourselves a railway. I, le I le you know, I legitimately, I legitimately have never heard, I've never had a bad idea in my life. And um, if you, if you mistakenly think that I have had a bad day, uh, a bad idea in my life, uh, then I'm afraid um, there's a gulag with, with your name on it, I'm afraid. So you better, you better watch it. Right. Let's see if we can do this in somewhat of a condensed form. Too sharp for turn. Um, I feel like there's a better way of doing this. Hold on. I mean, there definitely is. The problem is I just have a very limited a limited amount of space. I think we need to bring it right back. 135. Let's go for 135. How's that? Is that okay? I think that should be fine. Right. Uh, yeah, so we need to have... We need to have inputs, we need to have outputs. That I feel like would crash the game. I, I literally just want this to go from here to here. I feel like the game is very close to a crash. I'm gonna try it. In past times, that has crashed the game, but I think that I think that is fine. Uh, the only problem potentially, the only problem potentially is the length of the trains that we elect to use here, because we have had issues in the past with regards to train length. But you know what? Like a like the proper like the proper Soviet administrator that I am. I am going, I am going to choose to ignore the problems until something cataclysmically bad happens. And even then, I will not confess that it was my fault. Okay. Good, 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 good. Let's get... Let's get that over there. That over there. Nice. So that is going to be a temporary sort of construction. Start work on that. And I think we can... Do we actually have enough? We actually have enough. We don't need... We don't even have enough of these... Uh, of these train things. Of these... What are they called? Track builder things. Also, God, it's July. It's July. The temperature is maxing out right now. But it's going to get cold. It's going to get cold really quickly. Either way, that's looking really, really good. I'm happy with that. Petrochemical plant is looking great. No engineers and workers. That's fine. No cooling towers connected. That's not so fine. We do need to get that set up. Buildings without power supply. That's that's fine. That's to be expected. Uh, what we really need to do is we need to get all of this stuff built. We'd get all of this stuff built. We've got two oil wells. That's cool. We don't have any power supply over here, but that's fine. That's to be anticipated. We're, we're not there yet. We're not there yet. We don't need to worry about that. Okay. These two telescopic things. Construction office not assigned? What's the issue with that then? Why is there not a construction office assigned? I suspect it's probably just the number. Yeah, it's probably just the number. Okay, that's that's not a problem. That is not a problem. Source of steel is not assigned. There is asphalt, isn't there? I'll assign the plant as well. Sure. Maybe that'll make a difference. Citizen's loyalty is too low. I don't want to keep seeing that video game. Source for steel is not assigned. Source for workers is not assigned. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. That's all looking that's all looking good there. That's all looking good. 
have we finished the gasometer yet? No. It looks mostly complete. It's definitely coming along. Uh, but we need more steel. That's fine. We got hundreds and hundreds of workers there. That's good. That's good. What's our population like? 4,300. It's actually shockingly increased. That's actually ridiculous. Hey, that's great. That's good. That's really, really good. Okay, are we starting to work on this? We're starting to work on this area. That's great. Very, very happy with that. We should be starting to work on the... Starting to work on the tunnels kind of soon. But to be fair, I mean... It's going to take a while. 263 adults in this area. That is fine. Not concerned about that at all. Sources without steel. Why do you keep telling me that this source is without steel video game? I feel like maybe we need to get ourselves like an aggregate, like a proper aggregate storage. Let's do that. Let's see if we can try and build a proper aggregate. Uh, not a proper aggregate storage. I don't mean that. Uh, an open, an open storage. Not a, not a crappy free one. Yeah, build that. Straight across there. You know what? 11,000 rubles. 11,000 rubles for peace of mind. What a deal. Steel pickup point. Brilliant. And we will fill with steel, which is going to cost us basically nothing to deliver. Perfect. Perfect. The source is without steel. That is a lie. We definitely have steel. Why is that an issue? There should literally be no issue here. Maybe I need to get more steel? I mean, we only have 14 tons in stock, but... Sure, I'll store 70 tons in stock. I mean, it makes functionally no difference to me whether there's 70 tons or whether there's 14 tons because it's automatically replenished. Maybe it's a capacity issue? I don't know. Right, that's all looking good. That's all looking good. Excellent. I'm actually really happy with how this rail construction office has, has, uh, has managed. That is good. That is looking very, very good. Okay. This is going to get built. I don't care about that. We can start work on the prison properly. If if the video game really wants to do that, then that's fine. How's pollution? Buildings without a power supply. We'll never know. We will never know. Nice. I mean, I'm happy. Everything is looking good. Everything is looking great. You love to see it, as they say. Okay, what's our next big mega infrastructure project? Secret police. I actually kind of forgot that we were building the secret police, but that is happening. The courthouse is... So how the heck does how the heck does this work? Can we not just crack the, the sentences for crimes, like, up to max? Crime cases? Trial 100%? Location of crime? Like, can we not just, like... I mean, I know that we're missing the prison, so it doesn't actually count. 111,000 rubles, by the way, to build a prison. That's not happening. Can we not just... Can we not just put, like, all the sentences up to, like, life sentences? Can we not have, you know, execution for stealing a loaf of bread? Is that not something we can do? I'll tell you what we need to do, chat. We need to do, uh, coal. We need to do coal, and we need to do coal power. I think... I think we get ourselves a large heating plant... I think we need to get ourselves a large heating plant uh, with coal. I need to do it over here. Yeah, and I tell you what, we're going to use the bus stop over here to connect things up. Yeah, so we'll get a, we'll get that all done. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I've tried, I've tried, I tried using signals here, but. Clearly, the the trains, the construction trains, do not like to be constrained by the uh, by the humble signal. So I'm just gonna let them, they're gonna let them, let them go at it. That's fine. That's totally fine with me. If that's what they want to do, then that's what they want to do. Right, the heating plant. We're gonna start working on this very very soon. That's good. Oh yeah yeah, yeah. don't worry. Like when we actually start, when we actually start with them. Um, Trust me, I, 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 
I, I'm not great with signals, but I can at least I can at least uh, I can at least get a passenger service running. We will we will get that set up, but for now we will we will leave it very 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 well alone. Also, I am kind of thinking that maybe we want to just like accelerate our construction progress a little bit. So let's get a large construction office. Maybe let's get two large construction offices. Let's maybe build them. So 40 grand a piece. Yeah, 43, 43 grand, 43 grand. That's fine. I actually think we can get a very similar makeup from what we have at the construction office because we, we have plenty of people waiting at the platforms, right? So let's not, let's not beat around the bush. Let's just go. I mean, I know we spent two and a half million rubles and we haven't, we haven't made a lick of profit, but we're getting there. Four, uh, let's go concrete mixer. Six of those. Covered hull. Let's get one, two, three. Dumpers. One, two, three, four, five, six. Fell tree capacity. Nope. Maz. One, two, three, four. Paver. One. Road crane. Two. Roller. One. Tower crane. The rest. Three. Sure. Okay. Okay. Gas station's going to be clogged. That's true, actually. Let's build another one. I'll build a free one here. <laughs> hey, Colonel, how's it going? How is it going? Long time no see. Good of you to pop and pass them, amigo. I know, I was thinking about it the other day. I think eight years or something now, give or take. Bloody hell. I mean, time flies when you're having fun. That's what they say. Hmm. Thank you very much, though, friend. It is greatly appreciated. It is greatly appreciated. God, thinking back to the, the good old days of Factorio. Oh, simpler times. Simpler times. Fond memories. Fond memories of, of days gone by. Uh, okay, speaking of days gone by and days yet to come, when's my gulag going to get built? Secret police is 50% of the way there. Prison is... Prison is not there yet. We can't send anyone to the bloody gulag yet, but we're getting there. We're getting there. Uh, prefab panels need to continue to come out of here. That's fine. Bricks out of there. Boards out of here. Boards out of there. Bricks out of there. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Workers. Gravel. Yeah. Asphalt, concrete, anything else? Mechanical components. Oh yes, the 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 mission critical barn. The mission critical barn of um of Constructabad. Very, very important there. And also let's crank up the crank up the find range. That should be fine. The gas station is good to go. We've got a few more a few more slots that we can we can fill with anything that we want. We'll worry about that in a little bit, though. That is fine. Uh, let's get this one kitted out. Can I copy the contents across? If I was to copy the... If I was to copy this, chat, would it... I don't think it would fill with the vehicles, would it? I think we'd have to buy the vehicles again manually. I think it literally only builds the building. Let's just let's just pack it out. Pack it out. Pack it, pack it, pack it out. Six of those. A few of these. Loads of dumpers. Oh, I didn't get excavators actually. Let's get some let's get some additional excavators here to bulldozers too to compensate for the fact that we don't have any excavators in the other the other thing over there. Open hull, a few mazes. Yep. And Tower cranes? Sure. Extend that to 3,000. Beautiful. Is that extended to 3,000 as well? It is. Beautiful. Oh, you love to see it. Okay, this is great. This is great. So as soon as we get these, as soon as we get these rails done to the NATO border, 
we will be able to start selling our our gas. This tunnel is going to take about a Brazilian years to finish, isn't it, though? It literally is going to take. It literally is going to take forever. When do we get um when do we get our faster when do we get our faster track layer? It's not anytime soon, is it? Hmm. I'm thinking I'm thinking it maybe is not. I'm thinking it maybe is not. Let's also get ourselves a heat exchanger in the center of town. 1961? That's three months away. <laughs> we have done... <laughs> we have done like four months. We've done four months in three hours, chat. So by... By my rough calculation, um, it'll probably be about 16 streams time by the, fi by the time that we finally unlock our next, our next track layer. Bloody hell. What am I doing? What am I doing? Okay, heat exchanger numero uno. Oh god, I can't see. Not at New Year's Eve. Exactly. So it could it, it literally could be it could be a while. Just keep clicking. Nailed it. Uh I, I cannot see for the life of me what I'm doing. This is probably like a good place. Yeah. Sure. That's a great that's a great way to do it. That's a great way to do it. <laughs> yeah, we don't have to worry about winter for ages. That's true. <laughs> that's very true. That's very true. Uh get rid of that little cheeky bit of road there. Come on. Come on, comrades. There we go. I knew it. We we did it. Okay. We've got so much construction traffic that things are actually starting to slow down on the roads. This is good. This is good. You love to see it. I haven't specified any of the sources here. Specify source there. Source there. Bricks. There. Prefab panels. There. Boards. There. Okay. Good stuff. And mechanical components from... Oops. Mechanical components from here. Electronic components from there. Workers. Workers from here, but where am I getting the resources from? That's the real question. Asphalt. Joint that in there. Joint that in there too. Go. Go. Be free. Be free. Sources without bricks. That's a barefaced lie. Crank it up. Crank it up to 52, 52 tons of bricks. You know what? If I need to order more bricks, then I need to order more bricks. Ambulance not arrived. Oh, yeah. Tell you what. How's the... It's not the cinema. How's the clinic doing? Probably need a hospital now, chat. What do we think? Do we need a hospital? I think we might need a hospital. I think we might need a hospital. I mean, it's... It's close. It's close. We also need to build a university. So, get thinking about where I build a university. I do not like the fact that... I do not like the fact that we have no space left. We have no space left. We've created... A true monstrosity. Oh my god, we don't even have enough... We don't even have enough food. We don't even have enough food for a... Look at, look at this. The small shopping center is like is completely overwhelmed. Do we need a large shopping center? I think maybe we need a large shopping center. Okay, we'll build that there. And then... Oh, look! There's only one person living in this house. Demolished. Get out of there. Got a small modded one. Yeah, we got a small modded one over here, but it's barely managing at the moment. Um, we haven't seen any of our doctors atrophy, which they will do, which they will do. Ugh. Get out of get out of here. Okay, demolish that one too. Uh, 
Shopping centers first, education later. Look, it's priorities. Priorities, okay? As I said earlier, I've never had a bad idea in my entire life, and I'm not about to start now. Don't let me don't let me get distracted by building by building stuff that will improve my uh, my citizens' future. If it's not a miserable existence, it's it's not a real existence, right? I'm gonna have to I have to destroy like half of the old quarter. Like these buildings look lovely, and I'm just determined to destroy them all. That's okay. I'm just stamping my stamping my. Uh, Stamping my design on on this on this area. Right. Nice. Do we have any free trucks at the moment? Yeah, we got loads of free trucks. Loads of free trucks. Sources without bricks and sources without boards. It's just because there's a oh for God's sake, there's just These open storages that were free. I love how they're free. I hate how they suck. Boy, oh boy, oh boy, do they suck. Emphasis on the part where I mentioned that they suck. Also the aggregate storage. That sucks too. Oh, yeah, I need to make sure that we only... Yeah, deliver with mechanisms only. Yeah, deliver mechanisms on truck back only. Because otherwise, we are not getting... We're not getting anywhere. Not getting anywhere, anywhere, anytime fast. Oh, my God, did I actually build... I actually built that pipeline. Speaking of pipelines, how are we doing over... Oh, my God! Are we ready to go? Chat! I think we're ready to go. I think we're actually ready to start producing oil. Holy cow. Not very fast. Well, actually, no. Yeah. We are absolutely ready to start producing oil. Only from one, only from one, uh, pumpy thing at the moment. But that's okay. Okay, let's, um, let's actually maybe, let's actually maybe queue up the, what is it? Queue up the transformer. Queue up the transformer over here. That's fine. Uh, this can be a... A grotty little, grotty little dirt road, but I don't, I don't particularly care. Let's get a medium-sized high-voltage power cable. How much, how much power do these, uh, do these pump jacks produce? Do they consume? Twelve megawatt hours. It's about four times as much as a regular one. You know what? Let's max it out. Let's max it out. Let's, let's not, uh, let's not, let's not worry about the cost. I mean, it's literally only going to cost me, what? 5,600 rubles. Look, that's a rounding error. That's a rounding error. Let's build that road. And we will let the video game... We'll let the video game build this. Because this is actually quite buildable. It's not that many work days. Only 100 and 270, something like that. That's totally, 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 totally doable. Not worried about that at all. That's getting built. That's literally a number of work days away. That's cool. And then let's go around and we'll plop down some transformers, some electric substations. I think three for now would be would be adequate. I will build these because they cost a thousand rubles a piece. And I frankly do not care about waiting for people to be trucked out in order to build them. That's that's fine. Let's also just use the maximum best cables that we have. And let's also delete some of these fuel stations, which I have built. I built with good intentions, but they are now surplus to requirement. Did that even connect up? That didn't even connect up. What am I doing? Come on, potato. Get that in there. Good stuff. Okay, do I want to build these? You know what? I actually do. I want to build that one because I would like to start... I'd like to start pumping. And let's build that too. I know that I said I was going to let the video game do it, but I'm going to I'm going to do that differently. Right, we're on import purchase mode. Let's turn that up to like, I mean, it doesn't matter what we turn it up to. Turn it up to 20%. That's fine. Let's watch 
Let's watch us actually legitimately start to accumulate oil. Look at that. The quality of the source is quite low. 15%. That's fine. We're going to start to accrue some oil here. That is tremendously exciting. It's actually happening. It's actually legitimately happening. And you know what? As soon as these as soon as these two pumps are finished, oh my god, it's turning to autumn. Oh my lordy, it's happening. It's happening. <laughs> Bump that up to high priority, please. This is an important this is an important bit of infrastructure. Let's 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 maybe work on that one. Maybe work on the heat exchangers as well. Sure, we got two heat exchangers over here that are definitely not required. Um, we're probably going to need to get another one in here somewhere. Move people out of here. Oh no. It's fine. Demolish. Good. Get rid of that. Nice. Oh boy. I am worried. I am worried. Because I can see winter. It's it's coming. Good. Pathway here. Don't mind if I do build a completely horrific path that really extends the commuting length of pretty much everybody. That's totally fine. How are we doing here? Concrete can't produce... Concrete plant can't produce concrete. Why not? Why the heck not? Is it because there's no... Yeah, there's probably no... No regularity of, of, uh, of buses. Okay, that's fine. Let's have a look. Yeah, splits in threes. Good. Can't store or export concrete. That's fine. Okay, that's okay. Right, get this heating plant built. Get this heating plant built, and then let's actually legitimately focus on getting getting the big heating pipes to the places that they need to be. Right. I don't want them to be... I don't want this to be complicated, so I'm just going to do it, because I am, I am now... I'm now thinking that I'm actually genuinely worried about the population. We are at 30 degrees Celsius at the moment. That is going to change. Um, what's another word for rapidly? Very, very quick. There we go. Oh, as they say, Ochin Bistra. Very, very quick. Can't go over buildings. All right. Can we can we cut around the corner here? Oh come on. There is a there's a lovely thing about this game. It's a <laughs> if you build like if you build pipes constantly over roads, you can have these incredibly long <laughs> like. These incredibly long, like, elevated, without legs, bits of bits of pipe. I think you can do it with every pipe in the game, actually. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I find it tremendously satisfying. <laughs> look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look, honestly, look, <laughs> look at the length of that. That is brilliant. Okay. Now we need, what, two more? I mean, we only really need one more, right? Hover pipes, yeah, it's cool, right? It's a cool little, it's a cool little quirky thing. Okay, let's create another hover pipe here. Just because I can. Literally get it to run totally parallel to the road. Good. Nice. I do like how these pipes snap together now. That's also a nice change. Still, the biggest change, the biggest change with pipes that I liked was, um, was the, was the fact that you don't need to, 
you don't need to destroy the whole darn thing in order to get it to work. Okay. The hover pipe is is finished. Good. Okay, come all this way, good. And rant here. It's fine. We'll keep it as a hover pipe for slightly longer than here. Sure. You know what? That actually is quite visually pleasing. I, I actually really like that. You know, all jokes aside, I, I really don't hate it. Uh, how much is that going to take? It's going to take a hell of a lot of steel to get that up and running, but hey-ho. It's good to know that we've not wasted, you know, four hours just working working on literally providing one resource. A resource which I don't even use that much. Also, how's the secret police building looking? It's not looking too bad. We need bricks for that. We must be almost we must be almost there. Ambulance not arrived. See, that's gonna start happening more and more often. Monorail tracks? What like floating floating bridge floating bridge train things? I mean that's possible. It's very possible. Yeah, look at this traffic by the way. This is a... This is a grim... A grim traffic situation. Also, I think we're... Perhaps... Like, what's our unemployment rate? Our, yeah, our unemployment rate is 91%, but that doesn't really count. Can we see our unemployment rate here? Unemployed workers, 790. That's actually not that many. That's actually not that many. I mean, it's a lot, but it's not that many. Mostly we're just waiting on deliveries of bricks and boards and stuff. Uh, is there maybe a better way of organizing this? It's a free bus stop. Uh... Yeah, this is definitely something that we can improve here. Get a cut through. Cut through over here. That's good. Cut through there. That's nice. That's going to make a difference. I mean, long term, ideally, we're able to upgrade all of these, all of these walkways to be better walkways, all of the, uh, all of the roads to be the whatever it is, the electrified roads, asphalt road with streetlights and sidewalks. Yep, that's that's definitely a long term mission too. That's a long term mission. How's the heating plant coming along? Not fast enough. It's these... Okay, you know what? I I, I, I take it back. I take it back. Every, everything that I said is a lie. All of these... All of these buildings. Get your bricks. Get your prefab panels. Get your boards from somewhere that it doesn't totally suck. It's just taking too much time to load... It's taking too much time to load all these things up. And you know what? There may only be two slots there, but I would bet my bottom dollar that it's still going to be faster than waiting for the free the free stuff. Build a truck loading at this area? That's true, actually. We definitely can do that. Honestly, I think with two loading slots, I think I might actually be fine. I might not be, but I think I will be. I mean, look at the speed of this. Look at the speed of that. It's in and out like it's like it's nobody's business. Super easy. Super easy, super quick, super efficient. I'll see. I'll keep an eye. I'll keep an eye on the traffic. If if the traffic is too substantial, I will I will change that. I will change that. Sources without bricks. I mean that's an abject lie. Yeah, it actually takes way loader to uh, way longer to unload than it does to to just get the job done. Okay. <laughs> 14 degrees Celsius. 14 degrees Celsius. Temperature in the building is too low. Oh boy. Population is 4046. Decreasing. Average lifespan 65 years. Start at 72. Started at 72. Uh debts up to 615. Oh, it's starting. Oh, it's starting. Oh, it's starting. It's, uh, it's starting. <laughs> Temperature is too low in the building. 
Nah, it's fine. That's a that's what we call a big fat lie. Uh, because it is not fine. It is not fine at all. It is bad. It is bad. Births, deaths. Basically, basically, we should always have more births than deaths. Um, maybe there's an occasional sort of situation where it should be the case. Uh, otherwise, doctors should be having a hard time. Look at that. Patients waiting for treatment. Okay, I, I, I literally don't think we have a choice. I think we need to... I think we just need to build this stuff. Build the heat exchanger. Build... Build this. Build this. Build that. Build that. Build that. Build that. Build that. Build that. That's actually already finished. That's good. And build that too. Okay. Yeah, we have no we have no other choice. We have no other choice. We need to get it done. We need to get it done. Right. Buildings for that coal. We're gonna of course import coal. Buildings without a power supply. Does it need a power supply? Really? Is that I genuinely thought that was within range, but Okay, I mean, I don't think that we actually do need to get a power supply, but I will get a power supply anyway? Sure. Sure, just, 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 just do it. Just do it. Just do it. That's fine. That's fine. I am not bothered. Okay. Right. Could I please start making some money? Could I please start making some money? Also, uh, this route. Let's get another vehicle here. Oh, we need a technical office. Oh, that's a good point. Copy this. Let's, oh, for God's sake. Uh, give me another Lux. Have a look. Uh, related vehicles. No, I need to check here. Related vehicles. Check this line. Set a vehicle to line. Set it to that one. And just get you to go. Nice. Okay. Yeah, this is a... This is actually going to be a little bit of an amendment that I'm going to make here. I'm going to build this real quick for 5,000 rubles. And then we're going to create like a one-way system here. I hope. That needs to be asphalted because otherwise we will not be able to make it one way. Set road to one way. Set it to one way. Beautiful. Okay. That's fine. Uh, I guess I'd kind of like this to be one way too, but I guess whatever. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Uh, let's also see if we can try and set line spacing for this one. View line detail. Line spacing is enabled. Excellent. Perfect. Are we having... Any luck with the workers? It's fine. Okay. Could we please look at our pop? Our population is literal. It's just disintegrating. Lifespan is in free fall. <laughs> Lifespan is in free fall. God. Okay. Please, please start working. Okay. There we go. Okay. Good. The the, the temperature is heating up. Let's have a little look at the overlays. Have a look at the overlays. Whew. Interior temperature. Interior temperature. Heat water tank. 20 degrees Celsius. Okay, that's climbing up. That's good. It should be. Should be increasing. We should be in a good place. Current production percentage should be, like, maxed out until we fix the massive issues with heat. There we go. I think that should be better. Perfect. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Interior temperatures are now... Much more comfortable. Good. Okay, our population is hopefully not going to start just dying again. That was really quite inconvenient. That was really quite scary. And now we have just... Well, where, where did all of our workers go? We now have nobody else in the heating plant. But that's okay. We still have, we still have water in the... We still have water in the tank. That's fine. So the temperature should be totally fine. 
Also, is this not within walking distance of... It's not within walking distance of the kindergarten. Holy cow, what? Oh. Wait. Is this... Is this connected to anything? How is it connected? Am I just being blind? How can, can I not see the walkway? How is this connected to anything? Am I missing? Am I missing this? Is there is that a road there? I think that's a road there actually. But obviously like that is about a billion times better. Okay, well that actually makes also, this is not connected to anything either. Oh, wait, no, tell a lie. It is. It's just not connected as it should be. Because the kindergarten is still, like, out of range. This needs to go. There we go. There we go. Okay. Small tweaks, big difference. Small tweaks, big difference. It's like my, my five-year plan. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Okay, so that is going to immediately, like, enable a whole bunch of extra people to start working, join the workforce. A lot of people don't have a job at the moment. That's fine to be expected. How's this looking? That's looking pretty good. That's looking pretty good. The hot water tank is pretty much maxed out. That's great. You'll love to see it. As long as that is maxed out. Total capacity of all connected buildings. Estimated maximum drain is at 24%. That should be 20... Yeah, it's lower. That's cool. That's cool. Very, very cool. That is great. Okay, I think we actually avoided a pretty cataclysmic event. Global market report. What are you saying? The price of coal in the global market went up. Of course, it's winter time. Why, why would that... Why would I not be spared from that nonsense? Right, give me the... um. Technical services. Let's do that. Let's do that, shall we? I don't want the I don't want the free one. I want the I want the big one. Okay. Right. How's my my prison is built? My prison is built. Hey hey hey. Okay, that's great news. Also, let's get something set up over here. Sure. Set that up over there. That's looking good. Almost built with this gasometer thing. That's cool. How much oil have we got? 135 tons. Not bad. We're actually pumping here. We're actually pump. We're actually pumping twice. Source is not sending. Buildings without a power supply. What's the issue? I thought I, I didn't build this. Whatever. That's okay. That doesn't matter. That doesn't matter because we're pumping. We're actually legitimately pumping oil. That is good. That's a serious... That's a serious improvement. Oh, that looks so good. Okay. That's really, really good. And these are some good source... These are some good sources as well. Uh, yeah. You're actually ready to go, and I haven't... I haven't built anything around here for that. It's a 72% source. Uh, let's build another pump here. We don't necessarily have to utilize it right now. But... It would be good to build. That. I saw that. I saw that pipe. You had it. You had it there, video game. Building is in the way. What building is in the way? Perfect. Oh, man. Okay, this is great. This is great. I promise you... Chat, we will be producing oil. We will be producing oil any second now. <laughs> and if you believe that, you'll believe pretty much anything. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Okay. Up. Up, 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 up. There we go. Nice. This is looking good. This is looking good. I mean, it looks... In fact, no. Let me take it back. It looks horrific, but it feels good. This kind of needs to go in there. 
Is that even possible? I don't think that's possible. Pipe is too long. I mean... If it... If it doesn't have, like, a really sucky root... Hey, that's actually fine. That's actually fine with me. Okay. Build that. Let's go. I believe. Okay, let's let let's let all of these trucks do that. That's fine. That can just sort of that can just sort of happen in the background. As long as we don't like overdo this tank, I just don't want to waste any production, you know? Because we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna need so much of it to actually to to break even. Okay, uh so prison is up and running. Oh, it doesn't have warders. Could I maybe make another free bus stop? I guess I could. Sure. Uh, we'll have a... It, it, it's not a prison bus, per se. But it will be a bus between the prison. It's a very unexciting bus route. We'll do it anyway. Copy the route to that one. I can't believe this is only my second bus line. That seems crazy. It seems ridiculous. I feel like I should have way more bus lines at this stage in the game. But okay, fine. Right, already people are starting to wait here. Let's maybe not let passengers and tourists and students uh, potentially accidentally take a trip out to the prison. Okay. That's looking fine. Heating plant. Thank goodness the heating plant is sorted, honestly. That was that was quite touch and go. One prisoner has escaped this year. The prison has literally just opened. <laughs> oh. Also, is this maybe not slightly too many people working in this prison? For seven prisoners, we have 70. That is 10 guards per prisoner. That seems ridiculous. But the prison is now connected now, so that's good. Okay. That's great. That's great. Maybe we build the university out here, chat. Maybe we build the university. How possible is that? We need a technical university, don't we? Yeah. What about a university over here? Yeah, so I can't believe it. Even with, even with literally 10 members of staff per prisoner, one of those prisoners has managed to escape. I, I cannot believe that. I actually cannot believe that. Right, power supply, drinking water. Do we need either of those things? Did I connect this up to the power supply? I don't think I did. Where am I going to get the power supply from? Though? That's the real question. Yeah, let's get it from here. Sure. Oh, the secret police headquarters are finished. I mean, I mean nothing, comrade. I don't know what you're talking about. We have had no, you know, specific building milestones in the last wee while. Nothing at all. Nothing to see here. Please move on. That's never going to be enough to power this petrochemical plant. Never in a million years. We're going to need high voltage, aren't we? Uh, no, we're going to need low voltage. But the low voltage can come from the low voltage can come from over here. That's that's fine. We'll we'll deal with that. We'll deal with that in a minute. We'll deal with that in a minute. Right. Secret police. We actually have secret police. Buildings without drinking water. It's okay. Drinking water is a luxury that very few that very few can get. <laughs> The, by the way, chat, these secret police are going to travel around in personal cars. There are no personal cars in the country. <laughs> Literally the entire, the entirety of, um, what is the country? Slovakia? There is no, there is not a, <laughs> there is not a single personal car here. Uh, so I don't think these secret police are going to be very secret for, uh, for long. Let's buy them eight, eight of the top, the top cars. T603. Look at that. Look at that. Wonderful. Okay, well, now we can... Now we can, uh, now we can start work on the... On the... 
Potato Grad Technical University. How good is that? It's excellent. Oh yeah, let's let's take this way down. Yeah, take it down to like 15. We really don't need that many. Okay, that's fine. Good. Uh, we got a bus stop here that is doing very little for us, but that's okay. I need to get a cooling tower, don't I? Yeah. Oh, we're building the shopping center. That's good. Technical services. Can we build the technical services before the winter arrives, please? Oh, flipping aggregate gravel. Yeah. You know what? Let's let's fix that too. Let's get ourselves aggregate storage that doesn't completely suck. Yeah, and then we'll get truck loading as well. Truck aggregate loading. Just one? I think just one is fine. Yeah, it's good. Fine. Build that. Build that. I, I, I just want my gravel. I just want my gravel to work properly. There we go. Gravel there. Gravel there. And gravel here. Good. Okay. Uh, technical services can happen at any time. That's fine. Do I care about loyalty? Is that a stat that I really am that bothered about? I mean, I know that I should be, you know, from a... From a lore perspective, I suppose, but... I'm not sure that I I'm not sure that I'm overly bothered. What do we need? Gravel and asphalt. That's fine. Building the electric thingy as well. That's looking good. How are we doing with the tunnels? Oh my lordy. We are. I mean, I can tell you exactly how far through the tunnel we are. Literally 6% and 4% respectively. That is not good. That is not good. That is very bad. That is exceptionally bad, I would say. I mean, even by my own standards, that is exceptionally bad. How are we doing at the schools? Fine, actually. Very fine. Very fine. I'm surprised we've not run out of educated people to actually do the teaching yet. But, I mean, we're not far off a university, but... We're not far off. We're not far off. Okay. Let's sort out the, um... Let's sort out the petrochemical plant here, eh? Let's get ourselves... Let's get ourselves an underground pipe. I think we do want it to be an underground pipe, right? Yeah, let's go to underground lair. Can we... We can have an underground input, but how do we create? Do we have to start above ground and then go underground? Can we go down and then into the underground? Hey, look, we can do that. That's fine. Right. Let's go that over there. Over here, underground here. Nice. Start construction of that. Uh, what would we like to store in each? I guess this one can do fuel. This one can do bitumen. Fine with me. So that's going to be output. No engineers and no workers. That's fine. They're going to be coming. Missing resource fuel. That's okay. Missing resource oil. That's fine. That's going to be happening at some point soon as well. The cooling tower. The cooling tower. How much... How much stuff do we need to cool? And is cooling tower in nuclear? Oh no. Hold on. Please don't tell me that we can only unlock the cooling tower after we get... After we get some nuclear research. That's not the case, is it?
I have absolutely no idea where the the cooling stuff is. Dry bulk cargo, no. General cargo. Where the heck is it? Power plants? Okay, we've got it. We've got it. We 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 got it. Oh, thank goodness. Thank goodness. Okay, cooling tower does 12 tons a year. Large cooling tower, which I have, which is modded. Industrial cooling tower. To be fair, that does actually look pretty freaking boss. And it does exactly the same as a cooling tower. Although, to be fair... Oh my... <laughs> look at the size of that thing! That's the basic one. Wait, how does that do more cooling? It's it's smaller, therefore it gives more more byproduct, I guess. Okay, we have to get the big one. We have to get the big one. I'm obliged to get the big one. You know what? Stick it over here. Oh, but if I stick it over here, it's going to end up impacting the university, isn't it? But if I stick it over here, we're probably going to end up impacting something else. Kind of has to go over here. Compromise. 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 Good news is, we haven't actually built this yet. So we can go right through here. Thanks very much for popping in past the Migo. No doubt catch your rant. What do I need? I need a... Road overpass. Yeah. Good. Do that. Whoops. Horrific little bit of bit of building there, but that's fine. Actually, we can now connect these up, which is going to be good because that'll allow us to build. That'll allow us to get this built. Let's go here, 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 just to make sure that the people in that town don't actually accidentally end up with a desire to build uh, to build something. And then we can reconnect all these pieces together. No big deal whatsoever. Beautiful input. Overlaps with existing construction. What do you mean it overlaps with an existing construction? It is the existing construction. There we go, that I wanted to overlap with. Cool. Okay, I might actually build... I might actually build this just because I want to start work on the cooling tower. The cooling tower is probably the most important bit of infrastructure that we could possibly build, but there's a whole bunch of stuff that is going to be sort of shooting into action because all of the pumping stations should now be buildable and all of the pipes should now be buildable too. The cooling tower... Oh, goodness gracious me. It's a big one. It's a big boy. It is a big boy. Right, let me click through all of these things until I can find the right one. There we go. We need a cooling pipe connection. All right, output. Good. So far, so good. That's perfect. That's absolutely perfect. Let's do it. So, what do we need in order to build the Petrograd cooling tower? Well, about 4,000 work days by the looks of it. 130,000 rubles. That's fine. That's fine. I'm actually very, very optimistic. We are about to start producing oil. Well, we're producing enough oil. We're producing oil at the moment. We're about to start producing more oil. Also, is this... Yeah, this is within range of all of the construction offices. It's just not happening for some reason. Uh, there might be a somewhat... Yeah, there might be a somewhat of a shortage of workers. Let's maybe redraw this and say... Which one is it? The one that's got buses in? Yeah, this one. Let's say you can grab your workers from here instead. Grab your workers from there instead. Uh, didn't connect up all the pumping stations one to one. I think... I think that's connected. That's connected. That's connected. That's connected there. With roads? 
Well, maybe I didn't. It's definitely... It's got a construction office allocated. I think it's just because... I think it's mostly because the university is within range of all of the construction offices and therefore all of the resources are going to the university. Uh, the one up to the refinery. This one here? It's got a road connection at both sides. That's got a road connection at both sides. Oh, you mean these ones here? The pumping stations over here? I think I got them all. That's connected. That's connected. That's connected. I think I've got them all. I think I've got them all. To be fair, how much how much do these how much do these cost to build? Two thousand flipping rubles. Just you know, just build these. Just build them. Just build them. I, I really don't care. We're gonna need to set up the um We're gonna need to set up the power as well. Good, 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 good. Get that all built. Get that all built. That's fine. Yeah, without power supply, without power supply, without power supply. We're going to need to do... We're going to need to get another transformer. I don't think there's any other way about it. I think we're going to have to get another transformer. And I guess we can let the... I guess we can let the video game build this because... Should be fine. Right, we'll grab a high voltage... High voltage cable... Bring it all the way over here. Grab a power transformer. Stick it into the high voltage cable. Good. Uh, grab a road. Throw that into there. Brilliant. And... A few different things that we're going to need to do. First of all, we need to check, is this connected up? That's without a power supply, so we're going to need to get that one included in the power supply as well. Don't really want to bring a power supply to everybody around here, so we're going to have to connect that up with a bespoke cable. Right over there. Nice. Bespoke cable to this one. That's fine. And then we're going to need to get... Cable out here. Into there. Good stuff. And then... Out here. Into there. Okay. Video game, have at ye. Go and build it. Go and build it all. That should be fine. That should be all fine. What's the issue here? Concrete? Concrete is the issue? Oh, we're getting through it. We're getting through the, the concrete orders. That's fine. How are the bridges coming along? Actually, totally fine. How's the healthcare looking? Hella yikes is how the healthcare is looking. Patients waiting for treatment are incredibly numerous. I think we maybe need to redo this. I think we maybe need to redo this. I think we need to rethink our approach to healthcare. Problem is, uh, this is quite a good space for the clinic, but we don't have any space. Ah, okay. Move this vehicle around. I think we just need to... I think we just need to do it. I think we just need to do it, chat. 77 people waiting for 77 people waiting for treatment is is just too many. Yeah, the ambulances clearly need to drop off the last patient and then we can just demolish it and hopefully I'll be able to squeeze a hospital in here, but if not, we're going to have a bit of difficulty. Yeah, I think we're going to need to Maybe not significantly change this, but we're going to have to change it at least enough to squeeze in a hospital. It's not far off, is it? It's not far off working. Yeah, a little slicing and dicing 
and we'll be there. We'll be there. Okay, little, little, little cut up, little cut up there. That's fine too. That's good. I feel like this is... I've lost the... The original purpose of this was to try and maybe make some somewhat sympathetic changes without getting height from center. That's what I need. Without radically changing things too, too much. That didn't really end up working out. Okay, I mean we're gonna get the we're gonna get the bleeding building down. Is it gonna go sideways? Oh, is that a road there? Oh I can't I couldn't even see that. Okay, that, that road may very well be the vast bulk of our problems. Okay, we're going to be able to smooth things out a little bit. I just want to make sure that there's enough space for paths to get, like, around the entirety of the... the area. Okay. Okay. Let's... Let's see. I won't... I will build it. I will pay for the... What the... Is there something here? Is it just that path, or is it that path that's causing me such... such consternation? Very peculiar. Maybe I... I don't know what it is. Okay, we got it. 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 Okay. It's an ugly building in an ugly place. But it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Let's let's get uh, let's get the pads down. See if we can squeeze the pads in. This is where. This is where we might be. We might be in for a bit of a rough ride. But if we use the sort of, if we use tiny little increments, tiny, tiny, tiny little increments, I think we can. I think we can get there. Also, we can maybe utilize. Maybe we can utilize the uh, the overpass. I've not actually used these much though. Can't build you to infrastructure, presumably the hill. Although that's fine. We would want to upgrade this path. That'll build. I can feel it. It's close to building. Ah oh, well, whatever. It will build somewhere here anyway. Right. That'll build there. Uh yeah, how does how does this work? How does this work? Cut this, cut this right back. Angle of connection is too sharp. Yeah, how, how, how sharp does it need to be? If it needs to be slightly less, it needs to be slightly less sharp, we could maybe, we could maybe look to rotate it a little bit or use the sideways one. I'm going to need to do a very careful demolition here. Okay. That is a... That's an angle, but it's, it's there. Connection's too sharp. Does that just literally get us up to the right level? That actually legitimately works. That's actually perfect, right? I think that's actually perfect. Holy cow. I've literally never used these things before. And I think I'm kind of in love with them. I mean, to be fair, this is, <laughs> this is a very hard surface to work with. This is a this is a unique this is a unique surface with which to work from. 
Angle connection is too too fast. An underpass. Yeah, so... Does the underpass... What, underpass up here? Do I not need to... Do I not need to do it with a tunnel there? And does the tunnel not end up being a bit funky? Try that. Hold on, try this. Underground. Ooh, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see exactly what you are suggesting there, Beeswax. That is a sickeningly good suggestion. Uh, pedestrian underpass. Let's get it here. Come on. Come on, video game. Let's 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 not let's not faff around here too much. I don't think it's the path. I think it's the school. Oh, for God's sake! Okay, take it take it back yet further. That's fine. Build the underpass in here. Cool. Good. And then we get a tunnel. We go underground. And we go here. There's a flipping water pipe right in the way. Of course there is. Of course there is. Too short? Oh, for God's sake. Do you, do you need to cross the water pipe at the exact, like, point that I'm trying to... Okay. Go down a little bit, and then up. Yeah, okay, so the slope of that is too much. Uh, try from the other angle. Maybe it's kind of like the... Maybe it's like the pathway, where we, if we just sort of step it very, very gently. How's that? Does that work? That's actually fine, right? That's actually totally fine. Delete that. Good. Connect up. Which will be easy. And in fact, it actually works way better. And the hospital won't connect up, but that'll connect to there. And then... To be honest, that'll probably be fine. I don't even need to worry about that. Uh, sure, do all that. We're going to also build this entire area with rubles because we have a dire need of fixing the hospitalization issue. Let's wait for the underpass to be built. Then we will double check to make sure that everything is within walking distance. It totally is. That is freaking cool. I freaking love that. That is brilliant. Okay, no doctors with a higher education. That will be fixed momentarily. Let's move the ambulance back. This is a real issue. Traffic jams are becoming a problem. But the shopping center is almost done. Which is good. There's a lot of shoppers that are waiting in the front of the shop. And that can be demolished, actually. We can get rid of the smaller... We can get rid of the smaller one if uh, if we don't need to. Collision can't pass. Get you... Get you back. There we go. These bridges are 50% of the way done. Just about over that. Let's move your home to over there, and we will buy, uh, sure, that many. Yeah, I know I can set traffic, but I think, I, can you only do that for asphalt streets? I think you can only do that. Give way, stop, and etc. Yeah, I think the, the bigger, the bigger issue, sort of more than anything else, is the fact that we just need to get this done. We literally need one last load of concrete, and we'll, we'll be there. There we go, change home to here. Good. Okay, um, we have got a few patients that are awaiting treatment, but for the most part, we're fine. That's good. The university needs concrete. Everything pretty much needs concrete, to be fair. Cooling tower is well underway, which is great. The cooling pipes are already sorted. The substation, I can build if I need to. Don't need to worry about that too much. How's this coming along? It's not. It's not at all. 
This is a 72% source that we're missing out on having production for, but that's okay. Also, I still haven't I still haven't zoned the other half of the track. The other half of the track which is going to go to this area, like to to this to this building. It's not the end of the world though. Good. Missing resource bitumen. Yep, that's okay. Presumably that's just confirmation that our underground building is just about complete. Yeah, that's coming along nicely. That's looking really really good. We've only got two prisoners. We only had one escapee. That's fine. It's minus three. Our heating plant is working. The 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 tank is topped up. Perfect. 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 The only r real issue is is uh, is concrete. To be honest, the shopping center is is donezo. That is brilliant. What's the walking area of that? Honestly, pretty much the entirety of the town, isn't it? In fact. I actually think it might be every single residential house that we have. Maybe with the exception of like one. Like that one out there. But yeah, for the most part, that's it. That's good. How's our population looking? 3,200. 3,200. We lost 1,000 population, folks. That was how much winter cost us. That's brutal. That is absolutely brutal. It's okay, though. We still have, like, 25,000... We still have, like, 25,000 um, people that we can draw on if we need to. We had 100 more people in that house. We lost literally a third. We lost literally a third. And I think it was pretty much due to a combination of the fact that nobody was getting treated. And... Oh, technical office. Yeah, I forgot about that. The fact that nobody was getting treated and also... Heating. What do I need? Plowing speed, 23 mile an hour, water truck, sewage truck. Let's get these. Excellent. It's free meat. It's true. It is. Organs, please. Free meat. Free meat available. Okay. Good. That's fine. That's fine too. Excellent. Keep up the good work, everyone. How's this coming along? We're actually like quite far along, quite far along here. That's uh, that's very good. Happy with that. I think it's mostly just workers that we need. I think it is mostly just workers. To be fair, what's the average life expectancy here? Average lifespan is 60 years old. Participate in any sport, hospital, meets. You mean not not able to get any meat? We might have an issue. We yeah, the issue might have been the fact that just people weren't able to get uh, weren't able to get meat. We don't actually have sports. Yeah, sport is a big issue. Let's get a gym. Let's get a gym. I haven't actually got a gym yet. Can you believe that? I mean, yes, you can believe that. That's a rhetorical question. We need a modded. I think it's called modded gym three. Yeah, this thing freaking slaps. But we're not gonna be able to get that that. Gymnasium, sports hall, sure. And just 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 build it. Oh, I'm I'm building with rubles anyway, that's fine. We don't wanna we don't wanna leave that on though. Turn that off. Okay. Right, people are gonna be able to play sports to their heart's content. Let's see what the range is. Most of the town. Yeah, I would like to do a few more demolitions to try and get a few more like decently sized houses. So we'll maybe start sort of filtering. Filtering a few people out of here. Oh my lordy. Just as winter, just as winter hits. There we go. Okay. Now, what's our population? Our population... Population is about 3,200. Average lifespan is so much. Look at the deaths. Look at the deaths. Look at the deaths. Oh... Well, not much we can do. Not much we can do about that. We just have to. We just have to hope. We just have to pray that it's not going to. It's not going to. It's not going to cost us. Right. The technical office is going to do what it needs to do. Hopefully, we should be able to get all of the stuff plowed in a reasonably decent speed. A fire. Oh, to be fair, that is all the way at the other side of the map. I didn't even. I didn't even spot that. Whoops. Well, 
Uh, that kind of sucks, to be fair. But it should just be... It should just be rebuilt. <laughs> just a casualty. A casualty of war. A casualty of war. Okay. Good stuff. Uh, yeah. Snow plows. Keep plowing. Keep plowing, please. Very, very important. We plow more. Plow more and plow harder. Plow twice as hard. Right. Uh, yeah, I was building a, I was building a big, a big block of flats here. There we go. Get that, get that down, get that down. Oops. Easily enough space for it in here. This thing, this thing has got a very small footprint. Knew it. Knew it. Can we... Oh, we might not be able to. Hold on. Let me move. Go and... There we go. Nice. Okay, how's this looking? People without a job. Mostly people can't participate in sports, but that's okay. They now can. 32 citizens unable to get meat, unable to visit a hospital, unable to get electronics. We should have fixed all of those things. As far as I'm aware, I do indeed believe so. Nice. So this prefabricated flat can get built. Can get built reasonably quickly, I believe, because we should have all of the available trucks. Uh, the university will probably be done next, I would imagine. After that, we'll get the cooling tower down and done. I doubt very much that this is going to be built anytime soon. Although, to be fair, we do have a truck worth of people. Traveling time is, is at four hours, and um, we're approaching five, if you can see that. It's very small, but it's there. Yeah, I'm somewhat thinking that we're maybe not going to be... We're maybe not going to be getting very much done in terms of construction over here in winter. Although, that being said, like, we've got, we've got plenty of production already. Which is good. Yeah, that... What the heck is that? Oh, is that our gravel input? I guess so. Oh, look. I didn't realize that the, uh, the concrete mixers now turn. Very, very cool. Do we need another concrete factory? Is that is that what we're really sort of seeing here? I feel like maybe we just need a longer driveway. Like a longer entrance sort of way. I know that I know that sounds a little bit a little bit crazy to do. But if we maybe get the entrance to be over here and then sort of change it around. We'll wait until a few more of these trucks have gone. Yeah, we ditched that. I know that's going to be a bit inconvenient, but we ditched that over there. Yeah, and so now it's it's still connected. It's still the same sort of route, uh, but it now means that we're going to have queuing up on a bit of on a bit of roadway that is, you know, functionally a lot less useful for us. Uh, you know, it can afford to be it can afford to be uh, to be backlogged. Heating plant is looking good. We've got that's fine. It's good. We don't have enough accountants available at the moment. Trying to pause there to get 3,100. That's fine. We're, we're holding pretty steady with, with, with our total population here. It's good. This unfinished railroad is just driving me absolutely bonkers. There's no way that's going to be finished at any time in the, in the near future. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Actually legitimately works. There is another alternative as well, and that is to get a bit of asphalt road over here. Build it using rubles. Oops. Yep, and then turn it into one-way road. There we go. So you can get out much easier than you can get in. Did I, I do that? Yeah, I did that. Nice. Cool. 
I think that is, I think that's quite smooth, actually. I think that is quite smooth. Yeah, because you can't backlog, you can't backlog concrete, because obviously concrete ends up going hard if you leave it, you know, for more than 20 milliseconds to, to harden. Okay, well, whatever the case, that's, that's fine. That is, that is all good. That is all good. As long as we don't lose our population, as long as we don't lose too much population over winter, then I will be, I will be a happy chappy. I'll be a happy chappy. 21-story prefab flats. I actually think that we'll get these built very, very rapidly because they're very, very easy to build. All things considered. Concrete. Look at that. See, look at that change. That change is, like, super simple. Basically cost us nothing. And now there is no backlog. Everything works much, much better. Super good. Super, super good. Yeah. Also, we're going to need, like, way more technical services, aren't we? Do I want to change the priorities around? Uh, working range, do I want to change that? No, not really. I feel like if I do, that is going to be... That is going to be a problem. Uh, maybe I should get up the range just from the perspective of... They were clearly sitting around doing nothing, which is very inefficient, but... Probably don't want to push it past that. Otherwise, they're going to be cleaning, you know, every... Daft little daft little dirt road over here which I frankly don't need to get done like we can afford to we can afford to to wait for that yeah this university is it's gonna be done soon it's gonna be done real soon it wouldn't even cost that much to finish to be fair right how are we how are we getting on at the cooling tower the cooling tower is the last roadblock to getting us oil production Actually, no, that's that's a lie. We're going to need to build... We're going to need to build... Uh, build some way of transporting... Transporting our people. I really would like... I really, really would like a brand new... Uh, I really would like a brand new mechanism right now to build, to build tracks. That would be super handy. Good thing that we got the shopping center up and, up and running, though. Very, very happy with that. That's looking really, really good. Prison transport to the oil refinery? Yeah, the one singular prison. The the one singular prisoner. The one singular prisoner. I mean, yeah. Maybe, maybe in the future, but I feel like for now it's, uh... Yeah, not, not worth it. But it will be. It definitely will be at some point. Definitely will be. Right, build that. How are we getting on with the high voltage wires? 33,000 rubles? You know what? Sure, whatever. I'll just build it. That's fine. I think we're ready to start transporting oil over here. You know that? I think we are ready. Buildings without a power supply. Buildings without a power supply. Why is that the case? Because the power transformer hasn't been built yet. Build a power transformer. Just get that done. Get that done. Okay, now we got a power supply. Are we actually... Yeah, look at that! We're going to start to see oil move across here. I still think that we've got, like, loads and loads of space here. But that's good. We're actually moving oil across here. Which is good. That means that we are close to where we expect to be with regards to literally everything. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. The university is going to get done. I haven't figured out yet how we're going to do the university. Holy cow, I've just realized uh, what's the walking distance for the train station? Basically the entirety of the town. Basically the entirety of the town. Train station, walking distance of the university. I'm a genius. I'm a genius and I didn't even think about it, but we can of course we can of course transport people to the university on the on the oil train. Maybe that's what everybody was thinking that I was doing this entire time, but I can assure you that I only just thought of it right now. It's actually quite embarrassing. Okay. 
That's crazy. How did I not think of that beforehand? How did I not think of that beforehand? Okay, you know what? I'm going to build these tunnels. I'm going to build these tunnels. 106,000 rubles and another 106,000 rubles. We're going to let the tracks uh, be built on the other side. We can probably build these all reasonably quickly. Uh, but I, I just need to get... I need to get... I need to get making money. I need to get making money. So that's what we're going to do. This needs to be connected up as well. So we're going to get this out here. It's good. It's actually happening. It is actually legitimately happening. I cannot believe it. The university is done. Needs professors and staff and also doesn't have any drinking water. Uh, cool. I don't know where people are walking from. I don't know how they got here. Oh, I see. There's a very slight number of people. Okay, that's fine. Well, there's no... It's maybe... Okay, well, fine. Whatever. I will research engineering. We can we can do that. That's that's fine. That's fine. There's no there's no need to there's no need to teach students because we don't actually have any students. Uh, right. The railways are built. Let's wait for the let's wait for the trains to finish up with that. Got this going over here. That's nice. That's almost done. I think we're gonna try and use the same tunnels for now. Let's try and use the same tunnels for now. We're going to try and use the same tunnels for cargo loads. I'm also going to see if I can try and do something really sneaky here. What if I could maybe, like, get a little bypass? I feel like this might be an illegal maneuver because we got a water tower right here. Did I not say? Did I not say when I built this, this is going to be a stupid place to build a water tower? Well, I meant it. So what I'm thinking, what I'm thinking at the moment, chat, what I'm thinking at the moment is that we have... So the train obviously comes out of these tunnels here. It's going to shoot round here and down this area. So this needs to connect up with this, basically, right? I mean, it's going to... It's going to be such a horrific, like, ugly looking. Sure. But you get the picture. So this is going to is going to go all the way down here, all the way down here. And then this route is going to come back this way. It's going to come back this way. And it's going to connect up over here. Or over here. Either 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 place is fine. I mean it's gonna be it's gonna be an ugly one. It's gonna be an ugly one. It's actually but to be fair, I mean a lot of these a lot of these tracks are gonna be deleted. A lot of these tracks are gonna be I mean, this one, for example, can be deleted like immediately. This one was just to sort of help with construction. So if I if I do that, that'll actually be fine. And a lot of these can be deleted as well. Uh, because these were only needed for construction too. That can be deleted. That can be deleted. It, so it's a it's an ugly one, but it's actually like not. It's actually not. It's actually not terrible. It's actually not terrible. The only issue is is that we might not actually be able to build. We might not be able to build them with the the train things because they're not facing in the right direction, and I kind of don't want to squeeze anything else in. Oh. Oh no, <laughs> no, we were so close. We were so close to going a whole freaking game without a crash. Oh, I don't believe it. I don't believe it, Chad. I don't freaking believe it. F's in the chat. F's in the chat, please. That would be that would be appropriate for this situation. God, that was so that was so freaking close. What what the heck was it there? What the heck was it? It must have been it must have been that. It must have been the the the, the railway. It's always rails that end up crashing the that end up crashing the game. Legitimately always rails. God. 
Okay. Well, we'll give it a we'll give it a wee shot. I am determined to flip and produce oil. I'm freaking determined to get this oil across the line. Like honestly, if it's the last gosh darn thing that I do. I want to get this. I want to get this oil sorted. But that was a that was a little that was a little annoying. Maybe I just build. Maybe I just build them. If I just sort of finish it out, I just just build it. Do I need to go through this monstrosity again? Yeah. Okay. Except let's let's start at the. Start at this end this time. It's good. Nice. Nice. We do the bypass. Yeah, exactly. The, the, it can't comprehend the level of genius that I that I have. Okay. Let's try and make it slightly prettier this time. It's fine. 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 Good, right? Good. Good. And ditch this. Nice. And that just connects up there. Okay. Uh, let's fund with rubles. Get it built. No crashes. Touch wood. Touch wood. It's all fine. Let's actually just build the rest of this because I, I don't know if that was what caused the crash, but I'd really rather not find out. Okay. Good, 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 good. Literally, batch produce this entire area. Fine. Okay. I think that's it. There's still this area to build up here. And that might have also caused the crash. So you know what? Let's actually also batch produce this for all of the, you know, literally 20 rubles that it's actually going to cost me. Okay. Uh, we are officially ready. Also, I didn't realize, but in the intervening time, the 21-story prefab flats have also managed to complete themselves. That's really, really nice. That's really, really good. We've got the university ready. Uh, I thought I had built this pathway. Apparently not. That needs to get built by me. I will build that. Cooling tower is the last thing that needs to get built here. It's literally... It's literally... It's literally once. Ninetales, how's it going? How's it going? Uh, we are just about to actually legitimately produce oil. I can't believe it's going to happen, but it actually is going to happen. It's actually happening. Uh, we don't have a train depot. This is also very, very embarrassing, but we don't have one. Where am I going to build it? I don't need a long train depot, do I? No, I don't need a long one. Let's build it over here. How quickly could I realistically build this? I mean, probably quite quickly, but I'm just going to build it anyway. Okay. That, there's no way that's a legal building maneuver. There's no way that is a, that is an appropriate, an appropriate bend. No way, Jose. There's some dodgy building going on here. <laughs> what am I doing? What am I doing? <laughs> just just take it back. No, not that one, you twit. Oh, God. Okay. I'm committed. I think I... Is that actually necessary? Probably not. That's... It's probably fine now that, that we've finished construction. Okay. There we go. Get that built. Build that with rubles. Great. Okay. Right. I think we're ready to start our train routes. Uh, yeah. Whilst we wait for the cooling tower to get built, let's put that up to high priority. What do we need? Concrete, steel, pretty much everything. Bump that up to 3,000. Is that on 3,000 too? That's on 3,000 already. It's on 3,000 already. Good. Okay. Artistic rails. Let's get this done. Toot toot. It's time to go. Right. We need electric locomotives. We are going to go for... I mean... It, it doesn't really matter, does it? Sure. Go for the cheaper one. Go for the cheaper one. Let's get... Let's get as many wagons as we possibly can. Passenger wagons. One, two, three, four... 
five. That is going to carry the better part of 500 people. 490 to be exact. Go there, load and unload everyone. Go there, unload and unload everyone. And then go. Uh, you know what the great thing about using one train means? That's right, you guessed it. We don't have to worry about signals. Okay, we're going to go in one time speed because that's that's the only way to truly appreciate the beauty of, uh, the beauty of these trains. This dynamic follow camera is on. I wonder what's going to happen when we go through the tunnel. How is it going to dynamically follow the train? Very dynamic. What a lovely little what a lovely little uh, roller coaster we're on. Very cool. Open up the train station. Yeah, that's a good point actually. I do need to open up the train station. Hold on, stop. Cancel follow camera. We'll come back to that in a second. Right. Open up the train station. No passengers, but we will allow students. Okay. Let's see if that immediately changes everybody's sort of uh, working routes. Uh, also, let's turn this right down to zero. There we go. Turn that right down to zero because we don't actually need anyone. And then we're already starting to see a few people waiting on the train station. Let's go back into dynamic follow mode because I like it. I like the idea of it. It's a lovely, lovely tree right there. There we go. Nice. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. That is excellent. That is excellent. Wow, holy cow, that's 100 workers already? It's pretty darn good. Pretty darn good. More coming. So we're going to need to get... Okay, that's a problem. That The length of the train is a problem. That'll need to go... The, that'll need to go further back. The junction will either need to go further back or we shrink the train. There's no other way. There's no other way to fix that one, unfortunately. This is the correct sort of... Uh, this is the correct route that I wanted the trains to take. So that's good. It's like they're going around the they're going around the route uh, the route properly. We're not doing realistic mode. We're doing pretty much hard everything with the exception of starting cash, which allows me to actually uh, make progress in the game in a meaningful time frame. Um, hold on, let me get uh, some signals just so that I can indicate which way I want things to be going. There we go, and then this can be going way back. Nice, cool. Okay, let's see if this actually ends up working. How many students do we have on this train? We do have a few. We do have a few. Okay, we are ready. We are absolutely ready to go, with the exception of the cooling tower. 17,000 rubles. Let's fund it. Let's fund it. Let's fund it. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I would like to start producing oil, please. That length is also too long. Also, we're going to have a lot of... Yeah, we're going to have a lot of educated people, professors and whatnot, go across the technical university. That's fine. That's fine. It's just I'd rather it not be split sort of directly. But hey-ho. Okay, cooling tower is almost built. And we have no engineers. Well. We fixed the cooling tower. But we don't have any engineers. Any engineers waiting here? Literally none. Uh, okay, I am going to, I'm going to invite five, uh, five expert immigrants, because, quite frankly, uh, we need them. We are desperate, and we need them desperately. Whew. Well, I said that I was going to start producing, I said that I was going to start producing oil, and here we are. How long have you been waiting on the platform? You've been waiting on the platform for too long. We're going to have to clone this train. Uh, can I even clone the train? I mean, I don't think I can, actually. Either way, it doesn't actually matter. Cool. Copy the routes. Good, and go. Dispatch. Cool. Right. A full load of just about 300 people on this train. Man, you love to see it. It feels so good when you're able to get a really, really, really juicy load 
on on the train. It's very, very satisfying. Okay, nice. Oh no. Oh I I I need to I need to actually put signals in here now. Well there goes there goes my fun. Go. That's fine. That'll do. Probably. There we go. How long have you been on the train for? You got up to five hours. That's fine. No problems at all. Here we go. You're going to blow right through because you're going to the next platform. Do we have any professors here? Literally none. Uh, also, suspend research and actually do some proper teaching, please. Come on. I'd like to see just a little, just a little bit of bitumen, a little bit of fuel appearing here. Please. Please. Also, how many, how many people are on this tra next train? 208 workers. Few students. Any engineers? A few engineers amongst them. Not many, but a few. Literally none? Literally no engineers? Literally none? We, well, well, I guess we'll see the next train, but like we got 200, 250 people here who are just not doing anything. I mean, how hard can it be to process oil anyway? Do we really need any engineers? I feel like they're a bit overrated. No offense to any engineers out there. But how hard can it be to crack a little oil? Come on. Where are my flippin' engineers? We got one professor? There was one person on that entire train that's qualified to actually deal with... Okay, also the temperature in the building is too low. That is a problem. It's like 10 and a half degrees, but... Come on, it's January. It's, like, becoming warmer. How many engineers do we have on here? I don't think we have a single engineer. I, where did all the engineers go that I just... That I just ended up inviting? Not a single one of these workers is a flippin' engineer. What the heck am I paying these schmucks for? The heck is wrong? What the heck is wrong with this? Okay, lots more, lots more. Hospital is gonna drain them. Oh, maybe you're right. Yeah, it's true. There we go. Okay, cut cut down on the num on the number in the hospital. What about the school? Yeah, cut down on the number in the school as well. Anything else around here? I don't think so, right? Gym, no. Shopping center, no. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. How many have we got on this train now? 19 students, two engineers, two whole engineers. That's great. Fantastic. Two whole engineers. Also, I think maybe we want to get rid of this heat exchanger and move it slightly across here. Yeah, we do that. I don't think it's going to be too long. I think we can... I think we can do it. Too long. Oh, are you kidding me? We can cut the corner off here. There we go. Nailed it. Okay, good. Build that. Build that. And build that. And that will solve all of our problems. This heat exchanger can be left there. We can replace it at some point in the future if we need to. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. Okay. Are we actually producing any oil? We still don't have a single engineer. 
We've not made a lick. How have we not made a lick of fuel? It's not connected, is it not? You sure? Did I miss it? I can redo it. Hold on. Let me have a look. It does look connected. It looks like it's all one pipe. Let's see. Let me see. The S band later. Oh, you're so right. You're so right. No, it's too long. It's too long. It's too long. It's too long. Uh, okay. We can we can cut a we can cut the corner off here. Tactical, tactical directness. How on earth this is, like, related to getting oil production sort of working, I don't know, but... Believe it or not, it's very important that we actually do this. We need to find- we need to find a route here. We need to find a route here, chat. If not, we are in trouble. Can we go over these buildings? No, I don't think so. What if I just demolish the building? That's a great plan. Demolish the building. There we go. I am convinced that we are, like, we are within... We're within spitting distance of making this not too long. It's, like, very, very possible. Come on. Clean up. Clean up the mess. Go. There we go. That's it, right? It's connected. I think we've I think we've only gone and done it. I think we've only gone and done it. And that actually was quite an easy change to make. Although is that actually connected? It looks connected. It looks connected. That's that needle is that needle is moving. That needle is moving. That needle is that needle is moving. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Are we actually making engineers? Are we actually getting engineers in here? Please tell me we've got an engineer on this train. Just one. I want to see. I want to see things working. Am I going to have to split things explicitly between these two? Between these two buildings? We have two professors. <laughs> Do we only have two professors? Okay. Work there. Work there. You go 50-50. You go 50-50. How many engineers do we have in this train? Loads. And by loads, I mean like at least two. We're going to make fuel. We're going to do it. We're going to do it. Five hours into the stream, we're actually going to make... We're actually going to make our first product, which we are... A not inconsiderable amount of effort and energy away from selling. To be fair, that's not true. We could we could sell this fairly we could sell this fairly easily if we connected this up. But I'm not gonna do that. All I wanna do is flip and produce this fuel. Yes! Yes! It's happening! We've got them. 17 out of 25. When it rains, it pours. In a good way. Uh it's raining, it's raining fuel. It's raining fuel. Oh look at this. Oh look at this. Oh, it's fantastic. It's fantastic. I can't believe it. We've actually done it. We're, I can't believe it. I cannot believe it. We've actually started producing a tiny, 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 minuscule percentage uh, of the amount of fuel that we will need to sell in order to make enough money to pay back all of the different stuff that we bought. Wow. How much oil do we have? Probably like, yeah, 2,000 tons. A lot. And it's still actually climbing. Uh, no, tell a lie. It's holding roughly steady, but sort of trending downwards. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. We've done it. We've actually done it. We've actually done it. We are... We are teaching students as well? That's cool. We're actually making, like, meaningful progress to educate people, which is great. And most importantly, 
we're doing it. We're actually making, we're actually making oil. We're, we're making fuel from oil. We're actually freaking doing it. Oh, golly gosh. What a bleeding brilliant world this is. Look at that. 25 out of 25. Why are we not producing more? What's the issue here? Cooling tower is not connected to building? Uh... What am I missing here, chat? Is it power? It might be power. It might be power. Hold on. Let me crank up the... Let me crank up the power. How much... How much, uh... Megawattage per day? Let me crank that up to 100%. Not 100%. It's at 100% right now. Is it... Do we need more cooling? Cooling tower is not connected to building? I mean, I thought it was. I think that's working fine, right? We've... We should have more of a production percentage than that. Drinking water is cutting it by 50%? Is lack of drinking water... Is that literally responsible for cutting it by 50%? Are you freaking kidding me? Well, that's going to immediately change. I mean, still not where I would expect it to be. Sewage connection. There is no sewage connection, but is that a problem? I mean, I feel like that's not a big deal. Missing resource fuel, missing resource bitumen. No, that's not nonsense. Hmm. Maybe it is sewage, even though it's saying that it's not, doesn't have any issues. Hmm. Okay, well, you know what? That's a problem for a future potato. I don't care. If it's sewage, whatever. I do not care. That is, that is frankly, uh, not my freaking problem. Not my freaking problem whatsoever. Create a new save. I don't know. What do we call this? Uh, what do we call this? Potato, potato grad reborn. There we go. Good stuff. Right, we freaking did it. Well done. Well done to me. My glorious leadership has brought this uh, has brought this nation to its knees, almost. But we've still got 3 million rubles in the bank. That's fine. That's fine, right? That's totally fine. Anyway, uh, ladies and gents, we're going to wrap it up for uh, for now. Thank you ever so much for tuning in on YouTube. This was super fun. Uh, we're probably going to be doing some more Works and Resources Soviet Republic. Uh, at some indistinguishable point in the future. But, you know, stay tuned to the Discord. Stay up to date. Uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Have a good time. Uh, it's been good. Thank you ever so much for watching, everyone. Uh, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.